Confringo!
Yo, yo, stream's gonna be starting very soon. My bad, everybody.
Frame, my bad. Uh, I was trying to do some uh, social media stuff nonsense. All right. Become a wizard. Let's do this. That took way too long. I apologize for real on that. I don't even remember what I was doing last night. Um. Welcome in, everyone. I'm gonna go actually do part of the main quest. We're gonna fly there though, so I can kind of like warm up. I haven't played anything. No, this game you don't really need to warm up, but. Me unlock the next room upgrades. I don't know why I don't have those yet. Oh, my controller started dying. Hey. All right, let's do this stream. My bit rate is going way over what I have it set to. Good, good sign actually. I didn't realize if you pull back on your left stick, your character wants to do a U-turn. Shitty one, but it's a U-turn nonetheless. Oh, I forgot that I had to go to the loom to put on uh things, put on traits for my gear. For which one's Poppy Smith? Glad to be here at night? Is Highwing all right? Natty told me what the two of you did. Oh. Why is she way out High Wing's like fine. I'm something? keeping an eye on her. Maybe she is a fit She's safe, like... Poppy, I promise. Good. Whatever the poachers are up to, I want Highwing far from it. You said you had news about the poachers, and that some of it had to do with me. It did. I overheard them talking in the Hogshead, and... Did you know that they have orders from Victor Rookwood to capture you on sight? Does this have anything to do with Rookwood and Harlow coming for you in the Three Broomsticks after the troll attack? It does, somewhat. But at the moment, I'm more concerned about what else you heard the poachers are up to. Fair enough. But I hope you'll let me know if I can be of help, especially after what you did for Highwing. Does the name Horntail Hall mean anything to you? I'm afraid not. Why? What is it? The poachers best kept secret, apparently. The name came up twice, but they never went into detail. I also overheard one of them bragging about all the gold they're making, at the expense of innocent creatures, undoubtedly. The poachers spoke of this area, and I thought if we searched around a bit, it might give us clues as to what they're doing. If you ever meet my gran, this trip never happened. Not to worry, Poppy. If I ever meet your gran, I shall not speak a word of this. I normally tell her everything. She might be my best friend after Highwing, but she knows how I feel about the poachers. I think she worries I'll do something ill-advised. Whatever gave her that idea? Uh, this way. Oh, uh, my character's only walking, run! <sighs> I hate when games slow down like that. A centaur. Tread carefully. 
An entire castle to roam, yet you choose to wander here. Please, we don't want any trouble. We're simply passing through. Do you take us for fools? That we do not notice more and more of your kind around here, in league with the poachers? We aren't involved with them. If anything, we want to see them stopped. I hope for your sake that is true. Our kind is swiftly losing patience with the poachers and those they work with. He was certainly a charmer. That could have gone worse. Centaurs aren't exactly fans of wizard kind, and the poachers aren't helping matters. But why would he think that we had anything to do with poachers? I did notice the poachers talking with a few villagers in Hogsmeade. I'm not sure why. Perhaps that's why the centaurs are suspicious. Probably. Uh... Hey, come on now. Okay. That's the third time I've seen a dugbog behave that violently. It seems that a lot of beasts have been more aggressive than usual lately. I've noticed that too. It's almost like there's something in the water. God. We're getting into some conspiracy stuff. I show a poacher's camp. This is odd. What is it? Not entirely sure, but look around. If the poachers were here, perhaps we can find out why. This is for show. Why wouldn't they take their cages with them when they left? Still smoking. They can't have been gone long. Revelio. Pelt. Poor beasts. This is goblin metal. Seems out of place in a poacher camp. I should tell Poppy about it. Uh -oh. oh, I'm drinking out of their cup. Huh? Anything interesting? Poachers were here. All sorts of evidence. But I found something else. It's goblin made. I found goblin armor. Let's keep searching, but carefully. Merlin only knows what's going on here. Merlin's beard! I don't have a good feeling about this. Oh, look at Hogwarts from here. Dang. This How game is so good looking, it's ridiculous. Interests align. Look, down there. Definitely poachers. No creatures, though. So, so what are they doing out here? Let's take a closer look. They won't be happy to see us. Should we use disillusionment? Or perhaps a less discreet approach? Hard to say from up here. Let's get a better lay of the land. You can feed a beast, or it can feed you. I prefer the latter. This guy first. Show yourself. Traficus Totalus. Merlin, you think they were guarding the minister for magic himself? I don't What's think so. That was a little easy. We're Only school kids and we just out. did that. Because I'm like murderers. So like... I don't think they had that good of security. Like this isn't Metal Gear Solid. Like I didn't have to work that hard to sneak in. You know? Now I'm robbing all their stuff and I'm about to go into another giant poacher's tent. Oh lord. What in Merlin's name? Merlin's beard. Oh my Are god, there's a dragon. dragons. Oh, there's multiple dragons. Oh, so that's what those 
It's a dragon fighting ring. This is Horntail Hall. Go, Horn they make sense now, and the secrecy. No wonder the poachers were in Hogsmeade so much. Likely taking bets and spreading the word, given how crowded it is here. How could they possibly enjoy this? The centaurs have every right to be disgusted with wizard kind. There must be more dragons here. The poachers are far too greedy to run a fighting ring with only two dragons. We should take advantage of most eyes being in the fight and look around. But be discreet. You especially can't afford to be spotted. Hey, hold up. Wait a minute. Hold up. He did my tweet. I know. Uh... Cool. Got a new follower too. Let's go. I'm gonna actually gonna just. I already have them now as a thing. I think that's not like purple or gold. But gold is not. Oh wait. Oh, that's a sick outfit actually. Likely wise. Someone over there. Don't know what Victor was sinking straight in a bar. Uh, uh, I love that scene. Yeah, it's good. Uh, I love this stealthy nonsense. <laughs> this is my first time seeing dragons in this game. Have you heard from your family? Has even of your brothers come round to our way awesome. of thinking? Will you join that. us? Nah, they say we go too far. The violence isn't gonna get us what we want. <laughs> I say, if every last wizard is run through... Ready to fight! Over here! Alright, well... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Incendium! Confringo! Capulsa! That was not for to happen. That's not the way I wanted it to go. I didn't want to have to fight anything. I don't think I should have been doing this without proper meds. I did not go get meds at all. I could have just walked by, I think. They weren't even looking at us. I just wanted to take out more so later on. Just assumably they could show up, but they can't. Oh my god, they have hit the person. Terrible. Did you hear those goblins? Okay. Ramrock and the poachers must be working together. Poppy, something's going on behind you. God. What's going on down there? I see how to unlock it. They must have only just captured her. She's putting up quite the fight. Not a fair one, though. Not with her chained up like that. Combat. Let's even oh. her odds, shall we? Do this. Hold up, though. Let me, uh, let me. This room. Look, they've got a dragon egg. Hebridean from the looks of it. We can't 
can't leave it here. Not with the plans they likely have for it. Oh, don't eat. Take up the money, man. You go to Hogwarts. You're well fed. Okay? You don't need to be eating poachers' apples. Hello, Hamora. Oh, it's already there. Hey. We're in. We're in. All right, I have the egg. Ready. The element of surprise will only buy us a few seconds. Let's make them count. You're the one we're looking for, and you brought a friend. Back for more. Incendies. Shall we finish? <laughs> Wait, do I have any cabbage?
We don't have time. We need to free her now before more show up. Akio. Assuming that's what I had to do. This may have been a bad idea. I suppose we'll find out. Goes hard. <laughs> Holy crap. Well, I don't like the dragon. Kill these people. That would work in a combat sense in this game, but it might. Some spells would be pretty cool. That was crazy. That was a Hebridean black. I'm guessing the egg we have belongs to that dragon. I don't think she knew they had her egg. She wouldn't have left without it. What now? She didn't exactly leave us a calling card. I... I don't know. Nothing about this day was expected. Not the goblins, and definitely not the fighting ring. The last thing I planned on was a dragon egg. And the poachers saw us, which cannot be good. We aren't helping ourselves standing here. Let's get to safety. We can sort this out later. You're right. If there's anything the poachers are good at, it's tracking their prey. And right now, we're it. Be careful, won't you? I shall see you back at the castle. Fire and vice. Hopefully all the creatures could have got out. It's time you learned the transformation spell. After you've completed the required tasks, oh, my last spell. which I'm certain will prove useful in finishing your field guide, attend my class to learn the new spell. Afterwards, we will discuss your... Uh, collect the field guide page. Found Harbor. Okay. I thought I had the underground harbor one. Yeah, no. <sighs> I need to go sell some stuff. After this spell, all I have left is uh, Imperio and Avada Kedavra. Oh. There. Hopefully, it takes me off my brooms. Cool. Oh, this, yeah, I have been down here.
Oh, it's right here. Wow. Do it right there, stream. So this is the underground harper. The Grey Lady. <laughs> I'd say hello, but she doesn't seem particularly social. Revelio. Gotta do is through it, stream. There was something else, too a dash of powdered bat spleen, I think. What are you up to now? Up to Revelio. Oh, wait, no. Oh, go to the left. I wasn't even reading my steps, I was just... That book Professor Weasley asked me to find should be around here somewhere. Looking for the book Intermediate Transfiguration. Professor Weasley asked me to, uh, get something from that book. May I have it? Did she now? I'll give you this book if you humor me by answering a few questions from my quiz. Quiz? Some people call bits of knowledge trivia. I would argue that no knowledge is trivial. Hence, I have created a small quiz just for fun, focusing mainly on the lore of the wizarding world. Oh, God, I'm None of the other this. students will try it no matter how many times I ask. They all say they have enough with schoolwork. Ugh. They don't value knowledge the way I do. Surely you're interested. I'll even start you off with a few of my easiest questions. A quiz sounds like fun. Splendid. Just a few questions and I then I'll this. hand over this book. Let us begin. Before the invention of the Golden Snitch, which magical creature was used in a game of Quidditch? Oh, I actually know this. Uh... Snidget and... Uh... Not a snake. Oh no, I know this answer. I knew it from a long time ago, but I forgot. My brother's into this stuff like heavy. We're just gonna go with the guess. The golden one. snuggery. No, incorrect. Yeah, it's a snidget. The answer uh, was the golden snidget. Uh, the snidget was first introduced to Quidditch in 1269 by a wizard named Barbarus Bragg. Sadly, they're thought to be extinct. Next question: Which potion is commonly referred to as liquid luck? Oh my god. It's. This one. Felix Felicis. Well done. Yeah. Since yeah, it makes the drinker right. temporarily I don't know it by Felix name, but... Felicis is a banned substance in all organized oh, competitions. That? The tale of the three brothers involves which magical artifacts? The Deathly Hallows. The Deathly Hallows. Correct. According to Beedle the Bard, the Deathly Hallows consists of the Elder Wand, the Resurrection Stone, and the Cloak of Invisibility. Which ball in Quidditch is the largest? Bludger. Or the Quaffle. The Bludger or the Quaffle. The Bludger or the Quaffle. I want to go with the Bludger, but I think it's the Quaffle. I'm going to go with the Bludger, but it's the Quaffle. The Bludger. I'm sorry, but the correct answer quaffle. was the Quaffle. When no. a chaser throws the quaffle through one of three hoops in a Quidditch match, their team is awarded 10 points. True or false, Polyjuice Potion allows the drinker to change species. True. Actually, the answer was false. While Polyjuice Potion can be used to change things such as age or race, it cannot be used to change uh, species. I don't know about that. Hermione well, turned into a cat. That's what I was going off. Enough. Hermione turned into I'll a cat. I'll put the book back on the pedestal now. If you're inclined to test your knowledge again... I'm not. I, and I won't... I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. I, I'm sorry. I don't have time for a quiz at the moment. Let me know if you change your mind. I don't. 
I put the book back on the pedestal for you. Revelia ought to make quick work of this. Professor Weasley's tasks are complete. I should attend Transfiguration. All right, so let's see. There we go. There we go. I don't think I've taken this class yet. Uh, have I? Off on another adventure, are we? That gets annoying hearing that she says the same three things. There you go. My mother would like to speak with me. I believe she has learned about some of what we've been up to. I'm hoping she may be easier on me if you are there. I'm in class. <laughs> settle down, settle down. Transfiguration, as you may be weary of hearing me say, is an exact science that can take a lifetime to master. But we needn't be daunted. Almost anything can be transformed if you can just perceive the potential within it. As I see in all of you, tremendous witches and wizards, every one of you. Or it could just be my eyesight. Now, you all know what to do. It's like the easiest one ever. And it's the last one I learned. What up, Isaiah? What's cracking, my friend? What's cracking, bro? Beautifully done. Can we meet at the Three Broomsticks? It may finally be safe since we rescued the dragon from Horntail Hall. Hey, that's good. God, I'm only missing those two. Oh, nice, bro. Nice. You're ready for the next season, then. Let's go. I'm ready for it, too, to be completely honest with you. You wanted to discuss my progress so far this term, Professor. I did. You seem to have had no trouble in getting up to speed. I see you lower frankly, my camera just a tad. excelling in your schoolwork this year. Thank you, Professor. The extra assignments yeah, I'm have been ready helpful. For season two. As I suspected they would be. Now, yeah, it it's seems out. you've been making good use of the opportunities On presented Gen by your BC, field yeah. guide. Of course, the guide isn't the only measure of success. I've heard that you can brew an impressive Edurus potion. Hopefully, you won't need it anytime soon, but it is a oh. valuable potion to have when it is needed. Thank you, Professor. I will say I'm especially impressed with all you've accomplished in light of the rumors of your extracurricular activities. Was your visit to the kitchens and the Hogsmeade graveyard with Nick to bribe a ghost for information connected in any way to Professor Fig? Not at all. I'm fascinated by ghosts and um, food. And I was interested in learning more about the castle and the surrounding area. I see. I admire your penchant for learning, but do yes, remember it's that your like a very easy Elden Ring. to educate you thoroughly. It'll be the end but of the it, year it, in no time. It's not really like a Souls like game, even if you can do the events. things that you can do in I'll Souls provide lives. a final assessment at that time to ensure this. that you're ready for your exams. When I'm out Until the then, room, the well done. Hockey. You are dismissed. Um. Oh, here, hold on, hold on. I want to see this. That's pretty dope. Uh, not what I need on this class, though. 
Uh, the only thing that's really like Elden Ring is that it's a third person like so combat game. Oh god. Something dawned on me about the triptych. Oh, uh, you can dodge roll. Just no There's no melee force. attacks at all. I, I'd better keep an eye on hide. But I have another idea. I think we may be able to find what we need at a goblin mine south of Hogwarts. Meet me there and bring someone who speaks gobbledygook. I don't even remember who speaks. I remember our meet mentioning something about oh, gobbledygook. Yeah, yeah. Isn't it? Oh, there it is. But yeah, uh, Elden Ring is obviously a much more difficult to game, I guess, especially if you play it solo. But like, this game is it, it's more story driven and a little bit more linear than that. Even though I have been just running around the open world, just enjoying myself. So yeah, it, it's very comparable in gameplay, I guess. Yeah. Actually, my first day playing this, that's what all I was comparing it to. Oh, I forgot you can't land in Hogsmeade. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? I don't know which world's bigger because this world's pretty large, actually. Thinking about this, the Elden Ring? I don't know. Elden Ring's huge. This game's huge. And they both have mounts to get around and fast traveling. I don't know. Wait. I don't have her thing locked. That's why I was like, wait, I thought I passed where I have to go. Oh, I got that cloak. Let's go. Let's see that. Oh, uh, wait, hold on. My cursor at my cursor doesn't exist anymore. What else I unlock? Combat feeds. It's the very first one. I'm tripping. Oh, I got more. Wow. I got no assignments. Oh, yeah, because I have no classes. That's why. All right, let's see what this cloak looks like. That actually is pretty sick. I think it was my cape, though. Oh, I forgot to change my gloves. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I'm gonna go like, to sleep. I'm mad tired. I've been asleep since 2 p.m. my time. Woke up 30 minutes ago. Dang, mange. 7 12. Yeah, man. Hey, get some good rest, brother. I'll see you on here very soon, dude. The 15th, and all everything comes out. But yeah, get some rest, bro. You're not the person I'm here to talk to. Oh, she's right there. This is a change of pace from our last outing. Don't remind me. The thought of that tent still makes my blood boil. I've been thinking about those poor dragons in the fighting ring. The collars they were wearing, they appeared to be goblin silver. I think a collar is precisely here. what we found at that poacher camp. I've never known poachers to use anything like that before. 
The dragon that attacked my carriage was wearing a collar, and Professor Fig was so genuinely baffled by its behavior. That attack always did strike me as a little strange, seemingly coming out of nowhere. Surely you aren't suggesting that the collars somehow control the poor creatures? Exactly. Merlin, I don't think Merlin's the dragon we set free was wearing a collar, but we should check. And if we can find her, we can return her egg. Uh. That's a good idea. Oh, yeah, we I'm need to see this egg. through. I'll start looking into it right away. There was something else that I wanted Come to discuss with you. I didn't want to press it before. There he is. It seems I may have caused you more trouble with Victor Rookwood. Why is he after you? Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna tell her. If it's all right with you, I'd rather not say. At least not at the moment. Understood. Not now. We all have What's our going secrets. on, Devante? What you doing, man? I shan't press for more details. In fact, I should probably be going. I'd like to track that dragon down as soon as I can. I'll let you know when I have news of her location. Uh. Hello, Sorona. I received your owl. How are you? Hello, my friend. Did you ever find Lord Gog? I did, thank you. We had a good conversation. He sends you his best. Glad to hear it. Bro, I did that like I shan't ask ago. for details okay, of okay. your little chat. We'll later, and later I'll refrain from telling you to be careful yet again. But I hope you will be. Whatever your plans. I... of course. Your owl mentioned you're needing my help with something? I do. I thought you might be just the person to do a favor for my friend Dorothy Sprottle in Upper Hogsfield. Hmm. I don't believe I've met Mrs. Sprottle. She's lovely. Her late husband, Aidan, was a friend of my father's. In fact, I'd stay with Dot and Aidan the summers I waited tables here as a student. I've seen her a few times since Aidan passed, but the pub's been so busy lately, I've not been as attentive as I'd have liked. I wonder if you might pop in and see her. She may need some help collecting ingredients for her supply of Wiganweld potion. And you could retrieve something of mine in the process. A box, uh, full of old letters and such. I'll try to go and see her when I can. It would mean the uh, world to me and to Dorothy. Aiden was bringing the box of letters to me when he was taken ill. Dot can tell you where he might have dropped it. You'll find the hamlet just north of Hogsmeade. Please do give Dot my love. I probably have the blue. Oh my god, it is the distance. Uh, alright. Teleport and fly. Oh, wait, no, it's actually here. Uh, that golden one isn't her quest. I don't. Ah, up at Hogsfield. Now, where to find Mrs. Sprottle? Actually, Shane Bardolf thought dark magic was the answer. I reckon Rookwood's played a hand in his disappearance. A full day's work clears the mind, I think. Hello, Mrs. Sprottle. Actually, Serona Ryan asked if I'd come and see you. Oh, dear Serona, a gem, a gem. has been for as Berlin's long as I've known good. her. She thought you might need help collecting ingredients for your Wiganwell potion. And she's correct. My darling Aiden used to collect hawk lumps for me. Since he died, my supply has dwindled. I'm sorry for your loss, Mrs. Brottle. Oh, thank you. Love of my life. A bit lost without him. If you wouldn't mind gathering some hawk lumps for me, I'd be happy to compensate you for your time. Of course, I mean. Believe it or not, I have some with me. Thank you. How wonderful. The traveling vendors will be thrilled to replenish their stock of Wigan Weld potion. Sorona also mentioned that Mr. Sprottle was bringing her a box of letters when he fell ill. Indeed he was. I'd almost forgot him. I stumbled upon it just before Aidan died. He was hoping to go through it with Sorona over a butterbeer or two. Those two were always like two bow truckles in a branch. Aiden took ill when he was collecting hawk clumps on his way to see her. He made it home, but I fear he dropped the box in the cavern. The cavern is in the hills just southwest of our hamlet. 
you can gather hawk clumps and collect the box of letters there. Are, are the letters what I'm thinking? Thank you, Mrs. Brottle. Thank you. I'll be here if you are able to collect those hawk clumps. I and the vendors I help would greatly appreciate it. An astronomy table. Should prove useful once the sun's down. This must be the cavern Mrs. Brottle mentioned. No way, you guys want to actually fight. I shall get that goblin health back. Incendio. Confringo. Or clump hollow is what it's called. The hawk clumps to Mrs. Sprottle, but I still need to visit the cave to find Sirona's box of letters. Oh, hydration Perhaps station. Perhaps I'll find more hawk clumps while I'm there. Oh, headshots in here too. My bad. I have the multi-stream tab pulled up, so I can't see those. My bad, everybody. My bad, my bad. Oh, headshots not in here anymore, damn. Here, I'll leave the Twitch tab up. I'll just check that periodically. Now, I wish Hedgehogs would have commented. I would have said what's up to him. Better have a look around. See if I can find that box of letters. That's all the whole clumps for now. Mrs. Sprottle should be pleased. I already gave her something. And now like, hey, it does not look like this from above. Guess I shouldn't be asking questions like that. Ready again? Confringo. Either I'll have to fight that troll or avoid it altogether. Oh man, it's a level 30. Did it, but I didn't get the curse off. Incendio. Oh my god, I didn't get oh, I wasn't paying attention. Change this because these are pointless ass ones to have. Because I can't pull them back or back and forth. So I might as well have a bunch that can just be full one attacks.
Oh, he broke in my shield even though I hit it, man. Confirm them. Bombarder, incendio. Defender. Confirm them. If there is any chance that the relic from Slytherin's spellbook can help her, I must find it. I'm requesting your help. Meet me outside of Feldcroft. We're about to learn another curse! Stream! We're gonna learn another one! By the way, everyone in stream... Uh, here, let me check how many people are in here. If any of you guys would like to, if you guys have the time, go check out my bio. My link's in my bio. On my, If you're on my Twitch, at least. If you're watching on YouTube, then you're okay. You can do the same thing and go check my Twitch. But if you're on my Twitch, go check out the YouTube channel for Don't Panic Gaming. Uh, we're getting back into posting a lot more. And uh, yeah, we're also live over there. We're live both ways. Over there, you can rewind, pause, whatever you want to do over here. You can only pause and like just catch back up. Uh... Um, I have some promising news about the location of our Hebridean dragon friend and where to return her if you know what. But yeah, also my TikTok's in my link down below. Everything's down below. All the way down to merch. So check out everything. It helps support me and all my boys with the DPG dream. You see. All right, so now I got a... Bastion, talking poppy. Okay. Oh, so I gotta go to Sir. Hogs Mead. Or you just uh exclamation point socials actually in chat if you're on Twitch and it'll pop up for you guys. Sometimes I totally forgot about that. Lead to Hogs Mead. I'm gonna talk to her, get her quest, but not Hello, right Sorona. Now. I have good news. I was able to provide your friend Mrs. Brottle with some hawk clumps for her Wigamel potion, and I found your box of letters. Oh, thank you. I knew you were the one to ask. I'm glad I could be of help. Mrs. Brottle sends her best. Don't know what I'd have done without her and Aiden. Thank you, again, for helping her. And for returning this box of letters. It's nice to reflect on good memories. Oh, I do hope Mary and our neighbors... Are... Excuse me, sir. Are you all right? Just barely. But I don't want to trouble a student with my woes. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. I'm not so sure. I don't look Name's like much Crispin of a student, Dunn, though. If someone looked at my character, I don't I think they would assume I'm a student. Hamlet. Do the most business oh, in no, Arrowshire. A lovely little hamlet. Just stunning gardens. Just the other day, the Daily Prophet ran an article on its scenic hedgerows. Actually, before I go on, I should ask. Are you afraid of spiders? Uh. Spiders don't bother me at all. You'd be impressed by how many I've dispatched lately. Lucky you. The hamlet's overrun with the vile things, and they're acting abnormally aggressive. I'm going to do this it's in a minute. I'm not doing this enough. I would, but I have a crippling fear of the eight-legged beasts, which I, unlike you, seem incapable of conquering. I don't know what to do. I'll try my very best, Mr. Dunn. Please do. All right, we're skipping these. Come on, come on. I got to get hers. I can go Pardon do this me, pretty but easy. Were you saying something? Oh, I was musing on the precious butterflies I see near the edge of the forest. Whenever I come near, they fly off into it. When I was at Hogwarts, we truly were forbidden from entering the forest. Told horrible stories about it, and I've had an irrationally intense fear of it ever since. It's silly, but I'm insatiably curious as to where the butterflies go in the forest. You couldn't possibly find out, could you? You want me to follow the butterflies? I do, yes. If you wouldn't... Very well. If I have time, I shall see where they lead. Oh, how kind. Students these days have so much more courage than I ever did. 
You can usually find me right. Right here, because I never leave. She's been there since October. It's like December now. Don't it's like forget, Christmas. The butterflies always seem to be on the free. Alright, so now we're not doing the butterflies right now, lady. We're doing real shit. I'm about to go become a goddamn evil wizard in peace. Uh okay, hold on. Map. World map. Alright, we're there. We're there, stream. Looks rather dark in there. Never stopped me before. All right. You're here. Good. Sebastian, that relic you mentioned, I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment to study sarcophagi in this catacomb. From what I read in a report by the student, he said they weren't permitted so to weird. take it with them, so I must catacomb. assume it's still here. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. For Anne. I need to see her. I'm ready to explore the catacomb. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we've finished. Perfect. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't. I promise. I Good. Yes, I did it. I don't remember Ominous if I did or not. if you knew what we were about to do. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. Catacomb. I'm sure that foul smell is the scent of success. Try not to lose your nerve just yet. Swap that dude, those actually do help out a lot. Bombada. Confringo. Oh, I just wasted that on that one. At least now we know we're not alone in here. Perhaps that was it. And the insect. rest of it. Insect free. Yeah, spiders aren't insects. Don't start. They're arachnids. Right? I don't know. Barking on my ass. I don't even know what he means by that. Akio. Opening all of these is tempting. We're here for a reason. I'd say opening them all is justified. This room is taller than it looks. Wingardium Leviosa. Before we do that, though, let's go check this. Oh, that's where we're supposed to go. I think. I'm just assuming. From all the linear games I've played in the past, for sure. Yeah. Finding a chest in an inconspicuous loft. Brilliant. You could roll out of it. That'd be so sick. The character just became a parkour god. Confringo! Incendio! Accio! We've read Incendio. the world this time. I shall sleep better tonight. Accio! Incendio! Confringo! Akio! Watch your step. I nearly slipped there. Good. Gosh. Now 
Now this is the sort of great room I want to be buried in. Surrounded by grandeur. Grandeur and then some. Even an altar with a pile of bones. This dude is such an evil bones person. outside a sarcophagus. Seems odd. Kunfringo! Incendio! Accio! The Pulsar! Accio! I love how you can just like pull and push people away from you and shit. Like, incendio. All right, all right, all right, all right. We're making moves. We're making moves. There's something here by the altar. What did you find? Looks like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student summary referenced a space beyond the great room, which means this can't be a dead end. I have the report if you want to have a look. Let's divide and conquer. You work on sorting out the bone barricades. Evil, I'll look man. around and see what we missed. I'm just gonna Following learn these spells and he might have to go. There may be more to it. It does mention something else. It says their next assignment was learning the Imperius curse. Really? Interesting. We need to focus on moving beyond this room. But... Let me think for a moment. Of course. I'll start to search for those barricades. Brilliant. There's more to this than even I imagined. Akio! Yeah. Oh, oh, on either side of this archway. Hmm. Yeah, I've done this before. In, in Leave no stone there. unturned. Or in this case, no bone. Akio! Wild bones, I don't want that yet. I got it first try, damn. I just want to see what's in all of these. There's nothing over there, there's no rooms. What's this? Tabolsa! Akio! We're in a tomb. I assume eerie sounds come with the territory. Oh, oh that's not what I would find it. Akio, to Pulsa. Yeah, I got one more set of bones, but like Akio, the Guardian Leviosa. Another stack? Oh, I guess there was on top of the door. I couldn't see it. You I stand too dark. It's some Mortal Kombat ass shit, right? I here. knew we'd get through. I felt it's in my bones. Dude, I did it. You did nice. it. Nice. I knew I would get through. Not you. Before we trudge on further, I've just realized something. The student's diary mentions the Imperious Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered. Places the victim completely under the caster's control. So, if you'd like to learn Imperio, I can teach you. It's probably wise to know the spell. I, I couldn't agree shit. more. A spell that could save your life I'm shouldn't be unforgivable. I'm only one spell away from all of them. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. Focus your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. Oh shit, the Fantastic Four! Oh crap, the Fantastic Four! Ah! Here we 
go. Something troubling ahead. Be on your guard. Incendio. Confringo. Depulso. Accio. Incendio. Confringo. Wrong button. Look at it. Look. Oh, I'm only missing one. Kills instantly. That's so insane. So I haven't used one yet, though. I've never used a curse yet. Akio, Confringo. Akio. Another barricade. Considering how well you did on the last oh. one, this should be a cinch. <laughs> how gracious of you. Confringo. I try. That was so delayed. Incendio. Akio. Incendio. Oh shit, there's a bunch of them. Still. Incendio. There's some of these stone tablets have two. Confringo. Confringo. Capulso. Incendio. Never knew spiders could make such a mess. Bit dramatic, isn't it? All right, let's loot. Confringo. Oh, well, they already blew up from me. Ooh, upgrade version of my face mask. All right. Crap, crap. Buy a lot. That it? Only oh, I just seen the second one. Dang. Regular mountain troll. Forest troll. Fighter troll. Armored troll. All kind of the same face. They'll just like, mm. uh, okay. forty-seven percent done with the entire game. <coughs> Perhaps we need to pull the handles in the order of the symbols. Akio. Wells, yes. Nothing that way. All right, now it's time. To do you. This catacomb has suffered decay, just as the student summary described. I doubt anyone's been here in quite some time. 
Damn, I didn't get my roll off fast enough. To go back to something I actually have and not like not have something ready. <laughs> Akio. Akio. Okay, so wait, hold on. That worked. Keep Akio. going. Guardian Leviosa. And now it's that one. Okay. Akio. Okay, so I understand. Oh, there's nothing. All right, so now we had to go behind. Okay, so it's that one. Now it's that one and that one. Okay. Akio. This is one of the most basic puzzles I've ever seen in a video game, actually. Where's that one at? Oh, yeah. Guardian Leviosa. You are head and shoulders above these bones. Nicely done. Ah, I don't think that was a good, appropriate joke, man. You know what I'm saying? I just don't think that was an appropriate joke. I see why Slytherin's student was so entranced with this place. By the way, stream, everything I see is much darker than what you guys see. Yours is a little bit brighter than mine. It is very tricky to see things. For a moment there, I thought that'd never end. All right. Hold up, hold up, wait a minute. Appreciate all you guys watching from YouTube and from Twitch. Check out my Twitter, my bad, everybody. I would have to use a flashlight. Oh, dog, I got you. Look, Devontae, look, look, look. Lumos. Woo! Got you with the flashlights, dog. Look at it. Oh, no. Leviosa. Oh, well, I, I don't have my own. Incendium. Burn, man. Let me through. 
Akio. Dead end. Lovely. All that for nothing. Hold on. Don't give up yet. Rebellion. Really contains abundant. Sebastian, the relic. Look. Could it be? Big sacrifice, though, brother. You're gonna die. He's gonna the die when he is. And There's rendition some of the relic. It matches. This must be where the student left the relic. I can't believe it. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? I have no idea. But we're here for the relic. The note advises to leave the relic alone. I assure you, we were meant to find this. For Anne's sake. I'm taking it. Let's get to Feldcroft. I must keep this relic secret. Especially for my uncle. Is that... ominous? How the hell did that boy... Ominous. The sounds we kept hearing. It was you. You gave me no choice. I had to follow you. Sebastian, please. Leave the relic alone. We can find another way to help Anne. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. No, you're not. If you won't put it back, then I will. Hold on, both of you. Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine, but Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. I can't believe this. How much did you hear? Everything. I was glad to hear you tell Sebastian to leave the relic. We need to stand together. Convince Sebastian this is wrong. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. I need your help. Hey, You're right. He's right. <laughs> this seems far riskier than Sebastian realizes. Good. We're agreed. We don't Sebastian allow him to leave him with the relic. I do think we should talk to him, but I fear we won't stop him from taking the relic. What are you suggesting? I'm suggesting we negotiate. We allow Sebastian to leave with the relic under one condition. After this, no more. I feel that's what we agreed to in the scriptorium. I'm being taken for a fool. You're not, Ominous. This may be the only way to keep your friendship intact. Let's trust him to know what's best. Fine. If I trust him on this, I'm trusting you too. The dark arts seem harmless until it's too late. Go then. Leave with the relic. I'll not say a word more. I hope I don't regret this. Sebastian, we're ready. What is it? I haven't changed my mind. Ominous has. Let's go. What? Ominous? I'll explain on the way. Come on. All right, let's go. Ominous has to be some, like, crazy powerful student. He has to be. There's no chance, because, like, this dude can just, like, hank through everything. He can go what everywhere. What happened back then? Ominous and I found a compromise. Ominous simply needs a moment for you to change his mind. Is that it? I told him we ought to give you this chance, that the relic is too important to ignore. There has to be more to it than that. Tell me. We agreed on what was needed, Sebastian. You have my word. I feel like my character's instigating now. I never wanted to keep all this from Ominous. He just doesn't understand. And I did want to worry him all over again. Oh my god. As we were leaving, Ominous wouldn't even acknowledge me. That's not like him. He was troubled, Sebastian. Even though we agreed to it all, it's been a lot to take in. Couldn't bring up. Thought he, understood. he knew we couldn't give up. All of this is too important. Oh. For Anne. His teeth right there. Girl, 
so far. Oh wait, it's not far from here. Unavailable? Are you see? I gotta walk. Why do I have a bro? He is so slow. There you go. Let's get this when we get to Feldcroft, I'd rather add it to the to get the She thinks like ominous. It did only upset her. Oh no, this isn't good. The whole what town was just Smoke. destroyed. Over there, by the hamlet. Alright, well, oh, they Feldcroft's got some trouble. Groups. They're under attack. Let's hurry. Sister. With an unforgivable curse. From that damned book, no doubt. Your father would be ashamed. You've gone too far, Sebastian. Stay away from her. From all of us. Pain cries. Pain What did my uncle expect me to do? The Pain. Imperious curse saved Anne's life. And no. That goblin was going to kill her. There was little time to react, but it was an unforgivable curse. I acted in the moment. You could have hit all. him with anything. I shall make my the uncle see reason. He can fly away. He cannot banish me from my own home, from my sister. It might be best to let him calm down a while. May I speak to him? Perhaps I can help to ease the tension a bit. You may be right. Very well. Probably best if I get away from here for a while. I'll head back to Hogwarts. I actually knew he was going to do that bullshit. Almost level 30 year. I think 40 max. Maybe? What was he thinking? Pardon me, Mr. Sallow. 
What Sebastian did was inexcusable. You cannot possibly be about to defend him. Sebastian acted rashly, but he acted out of instinct to save Anne. Out of instinct? With an unforgivable curse? This family does not resort to using dark magic, even against our enemies. What Sebastian did cannot be undone. That you are defending Sebastian's behavior at all tells me everything I need to know. You are as guilty as he is. Sebastian is to come nowhere near Feldcroft, nowhere near Anne. Unforgivable curses are so named for a reason. If I hear that either of you continues down this path, if either of you uses dark magic, I will notify the headmaster immediately. Why, Sebastian? Is she here, actually? Uh, can I talk to her? What is she doing? What is she doing? Undercroft. Oh, I'm not gonna walk there. What the hell? Uh, Hogwarts. Oh, where was it? Is it here? Oh, I guess it's in. I charms. I no, I'll just walk there from here. As long as I'm in the castle, I'm not going there from way down there though. That's ridiculous. She was humming again. Oh, that's why you were so bothered. Of course I was bothered. Oh. It's enough trying to memorize dates for oh, bits oh, without oh, being oh. pounded by a horrible tune that peeves like... Oh. Why did it have me go the other way? It would have been much slower. Just cracking on. Did you speak with my uncle? I wish I had better news about your uncle and Anne. Well, what did he say? I'm afraid he wants you nowhere near Feldcroft. Nor Anne. I had to stop that goblin from killing my sister. Hit. He had no Ozo. right to banish me from my own twin. Endo. If he thinks banishing me means I'm going to give up on Anne, he's sorely mistaken. He also said he cannot excuse the use of dark magic in any form, and that if he hears of either of us using it, he'll go straight to Professor Black. Huh? That relic, dark magic or not, is the key to saving Anne, to reverse that curse. I will not lose Anne for good. I should send the crest to Anne. She'll know that we need to meet. I'm afraid I don't follow. Nothing, just a thought. Now I'm more determined than ever to learn what power that relic has. What did you mean you'd send Anna Crest so that she'd know to meet you? It's... we just lost our parents, and we were packing up to go and live with Solomon. We couldn't take everything. She was carefully organizing her prized possessions, a box of artifacts she'd collected to do with our family. Jewelry, cards, old photographs. She got to her favorite, a handmade crest, and without a second thought, she handed it to me. This will keep you safe, she said. It holds no enchantment, but I've kept it with me since. That's how I can reach Anne. I'll get the crest to her with plans to meet. Be careful, Sebastian. Your uncle could intercept it. We'll be expelled. Even if Ominous is upset with us, he has no love lost for his family. He'd use their connections to the Headmaster if we needed his help. All right. 
I shall wait to hear from you then. Thank you. I very much appreciate you standing by me through all of this. I'll send you an owl when I have news. Because that in combat Imperial is actually like a unforgivable curse. I get it if you're in like in daily life. You can't just control people to do what you want. But like in combat, it's kind of understandable. Because like imagine you're a wizard and all your people are dead around you. And you need to be able to beat these people, not let them escape. You could use it on one of them. What up, Dorita? But yeah, like, you know, it, it kind of makes sense, even though it's still, like, pretty messed up to do. House ghosts can procure rents needed. Uh, what's up? What is this? All right, going upstairs. The peeves go. Look at them go. Then leave me alone, peeves. <laughs> Hello there. Hello, I'll meet. Do I recall you saying that you speak gobbledygook? I did. I mean, I do. Speak it. Is this to do with the goblin I saw you with in Hogsmeade? It is. His name is Lodgok. Stalker. We could use your help with something. He's waiting for me near a goblin mine. Would you be willing to help? Of course. How exciting. I mean, well, might this be dangerous? I think he simply wants to show me something that involves gobbledygook. If it helps, he's a friend of Serona's. Good to hear. Good to hear. If Serona trusts him, then I feel much better. Uh, Lord Gok is waiting. Should we go? Of course. I just want to check the pronunciation of a couple of key terms first. So I will meet you there. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. There's a page there. Revelio. Uh, uh, we're open. Let's hope this is the right one. If it's not, it's whatever. Not a big deal. What are you up to now? A friend who speaks gobbledygook is meeting us. Before he arrives, perhaps you could tell me why we're here? Of course. Unfortunately, presenting Ranrock with the helmet of Earthgot did not have the effect I'd hoped. Because he knew the details surrounding its plunder, he presumed I'd had help from a witch or wizard in retrieving it. You said this would repair the castle. He's kind of addicted to this guy because I don't trust him. How did you not expect him to react this way? I'm afraid we do not have the luxury of rational expectation when it comes to Ranrock. Damn Bragbor and his blasted journals. Bragbor? An ancestor of Ranrock's, renowned metal worker. If we are to work together, I suppose I must tell you more. Not long ago, Ranrock sent me to collect a recently unearthed set of Bragbor's journals. They described repositories that Bragbor had been commissioned to build for a group of witches and wizards. What do you mean, repositories? Large, magically fortified receptacles crafted from goblin metal. Ranrock recruited others to help me locate the repositories. We were to search anywhere that was connected to five names mentioned in the journals. Rackham, Fitzgerald, Bacar, Morganock, and Rookwood. Rookwood Castle. That is where we began our search. Why does Ranrock care so much about these repositories? 
He cares about what they contain. For centuries, wizards have refused to share their magical knowledge with goblins. <laughs> Your kind will not even let us carry wands. Thus, many goblins, myself included, have spent our lives mistrusting wizard kind. Ranrock was convinced that the repositories contained a magical power that wizards wanted to keep for themselves. He was, is, determined to hey, take my it YouTube for video goblin has, kind. Or my YouTube stream has three but likes. Here comes go. my friend Armit. Let's go. Probably best to continue our conversation later. Greetings, Lord Gok. It is an honor, sir. You speak gobbledygook. Enough! Please do not tell me that was meant to be gobbledygook. I am. Um, well, yes. Perhaps my pronunciation was a bit off. I imagine certain dialects differ. Pronunciation is not the issue. I barely recognize that as language. I trust you can read gobbledygook better than you can speak it? I can, Sir Lodcock. Just Lodgok. Thankfully, we only need someone who can decipher written plans, since I cannot join you in the mine. What written plans? And why can't you come with us? We need some idea of what Ranrock knows or is plotting. I suspect a careless loyalist may have left plans behind. And I'm unable to join you because I cannot risk anyone reporting my presence to Ranrock. All you need to do is not be seen, either by the eye above the enchanted door or a loitering loyalist. Huh? I'm a hungry streamer, I'm not gonna lie. I'll meet and I can do this. I will await your return. I shall see you soon. Hopefully close to the pine to like be like he's not willing to risk being seen with us. But we're really close to the mine, like <laughs> Door is looking at us. Ah, run away. Wait, hold up. Lumos. Not wrong. Lumos. Yes, of Korean stream. I'm hungry though. Like I said. So rarely prepare one for reality. A real goblin mine. It's even grander than I had expected. I'm quite good at sneaking about. You'll see. Sure. I haven't seen him in school since I seen I him the first time. I believe I met a goblin. Let's just learn what we can and get out. Look at this lift. Impressive workmanship for so simple a device. Impressive workmanship aside, it's the only way forward. I've read about minds like this, but seeing one is something else altogether. I don't know if this dude knows how to jump. Akio. Keep your wits about you, I'll meet. I'll get you through this mine.
What's the point of being able to go up here? We're being watched by a door. Why is a grapple you are? Matter of time till Ranrock sets things right. Mr. Talus. He won't get through as long as we. That was a little more than I'm used to. I'll get us through his safety. Line. You have my word. I mean, he doesn't get hurt. He's like, he, he's a cool kid. But yeah, no bad for these. Is that aren't really into combat? If they get hurt, I, I feel kind of. Good. I feel like a character from one of the adventure books I read during the summer holidays. Let's take a look around, Armit. See if we can find any plans. Bow, a schematic. They're building something. I can't quite make it out. Curious. There must be more notes around here. What could they be building? There's a book right there. If I'm translating this correctly, and I think that I am, they're building something rather large. But what? Let me know if you see any more plans or schematics. We can't return to Lodgok empty-headed. Try to go the other way. I don't want to risk getting caught. That's the last loyalist. What just happened? That was crazy. I don't understand. Fascinating to see gobbledygook written in a goblin hand. The flourishes are extraordinary. I will get to the bottom of what they've been building down here. blow up a um, red barrel in a room without them knowing I'm there. Well, they know I'm there. Well, they like somehow spot me automatically like most games would do because it's kind of trashy. Well, this might be the best meal I've had in years. No, I mean it. Just find money. I know I heard something. Yeah. What a cool little new car. <laughs> Incendio. Uh. 
face <laughs> stay close i've handled much worse another boiler this place is more Rebellion. complex than i had expected oh the favor there all right another schematic what are they going to build this mine is too small for whatever it is <sighs> incendio the batter running what they're doing. None of these are lit. Get trash. Oh yeah. The pulsa. I wonder if the boiler powers the lever. I Akio. The pulsa. I can go in. There. Maybe I will actually. Akio. Now that will open. We're not doing that yet. We're going to go over here first. Oh, right here. What? Check the YouTube comments. Head. Rebellion. Yeah, they're blue. Nope. The level, right? Is where... Devil's snare. Nasty stuff if we're not careful. Lumos. Lumos. Not an entanglement we need right now. Devils. I need a mallow sweet, I think. Not dit me. Revelio. Lumos. Lumos. Oh, Devil Snares actually in there. That is so awesome. Why can't I aim with my wand right now? Bring me another humans to battle. I'll take them all. Run the other way when they see me. Oh, it's totalis. Every time. Let me pause and see if I can aim now. Can't aim. Oh no, he's gonna come up here. Revelio. We're good. We're good. We're good. Why am I always on patrol? It's a waste of my skills. Oh no.
Not your best moment, I fear. One less human to worry about. Should be the last of them, I mean. Amelian. Revelio. Oh, hello, meds. Let's go. Akio. Oh. Oh, we're not going down there. That's where you're supposed to go. After you do this, huh? This is not good. They're building enormous drills. Bigger than this mine could contain. Let's get out of here and tell Lodgot what we found. I need a moment to catch my breath. This uh, was more me. than I bargained for. I'm glad you came with me, Omit. Now that we know what they're up to, we can get out of here. Revelio. Hold up. We might Hello, as well. I didn't get stuck in the door this time. Revelio. Or the. We're almost out of here, our meat. Look, the lift. 
welcome sight indeed. Look, the lift. We've been in here for like four minutes in total. Like, oh, you guys are good, huh? Can we please talk about what just happened? That wasn't so bad, was it? It was. It really was. I'm afraid I've had enough adventure for one day. For a lifetime, perhaps. Thank you, Amit. I couldn't have done it without you. Now, if you don't mind, I'd like to have a word with Lodgok. Understood. I'll leave you to it. Your goblin secrets are safe with me. But I get to write the book about this escapade someday. Without oh. further ado, at you. All right. They're building enormous drills. We found their plans. Ranrock must be searching for the repositories. I fear you are correct. Other than Rookwood Castle, however, I do not know where else he plans to search. I've been wondering about something else you said before we entered the mine. Yes? If you share Ranrock's views, then why are you helping me? I expected Rookwood Castle to be deserted when I arrived to begin my search. So I was surprised to find a witch there who had set up a sort of improvised research site. She was studying something so intently that she almost didn't notice me. When she looked up, I thought she would react with fear or disdain. But instead, she did something that I will never forget. Without a moment's hesitation, she smiled and asked me to sit with her. She told me that she was a researcher and showed me a small, oddly shaped container with a strange symbol on it. She was certain it was made of goblin metal, but was unable to open it. She wanted to work together. Miriam. Yes. But how did you... Professor Fig's wife. He told me of her research. And I know of the container. Ah. The reverence with which she talked of goblins and their intelligence and skill, it caught me entirely off guard. I'd never been treated with such respect by a witch or wizard. So, to my surprise, I let her study the container if she would allow me to search the castle on my own. We parted ways, with her promising to share what she'd learned. More of Ranrock's recruits arrived, and we began to dig, eventually locating the first repository. Ranrock was thrilled with our discovery, but furious when I told him about Miriam. Berated me for trusting a witch when I heard she had been killed. You think Ranrock murdered her? I don't want to believe it, but I don't know. After that, something shifted in me. I had seen how the power from the repositories was transforming Ranrock, transforming all of them. I could no longer remain a part of it. Thank you, Lodcock, for telling me this. Hmm. I tell you all of this so that you understand what is at stake. <sighs> Ranrock never found all of Bragbor's journals, but the ones he did find suggest that Bragbor, at some point, built a repository far greater in size than the one beneath Rookwood Castle. What you've discovered here today worries me deeply. If Ranrock learns of the location of that repository, I fear we shall be destined for a great war. I will find out what Ranrock knows. Watch for my owl.
right, stream. That was a big info dump right there. Mm. How long have you been streaming? Two and a half now? Hell yeah. Thank you guys for sticking with me for this. There's stuff on top of this. I don't know why a lot of the map just stinks. There isn't. There are these areas, though, that I don't know why they're a thing. So. What the hell? The dragon, where's it flying to? Dragon I need to return the egg to, right? Fifty percent yet? Eight. That's crazy. Ugh. All right. All right. Ugh. All right. So now I go to my quest. See what my next main. Holy smokes, 2,800. No. Like, I'd be down. Oh. That's just a long flight for no reason. I just realized I'm out of frame of it. Oh, wait, hold up. Hold up, hold up. Go back to the screen. Y'all can see it. I didn't realize it's dark enough out so I can... It's like a place. Bardo. Boom. I thought my owl might pique your interest. I came as soon as I could. I'd been so preoccupied by all that happened with Ominous in the catacomb, not to mention my uncle's reaction, that I'd almost forgotten what it was that struck me about that triptych. This is the view painted on the canvas that was left on it. That's incredible. You know this area well. And while I was waiting for you, I scouted around and discovered an abandoned mine nearby, surrounded by Ranrock's loyalists. Do you think there's a connection to the triptych? I have Ryan no idea, to to but parents. perhaps they're searching it, her the mom, way they did Brookwood Castle and something. Isadora's Manor. How do we want to handle this? We need to see what they're doing, but let's not draw their attention. Very well. And I still have that rune symbol we found on the triptych. If there is a connection, I suspect we'll see that symbol again. After you. I'm sure I can't summon my broom. Ugh. Look at this. There they are up ahead. I'll let you lead. When the war is over, goblins will rule over wizards at last. No one enters this mine. Kill anyone who tries. Ranrock's loyalists are out for blood. Well, so I have a new talent, and I forgot. I wanted to actually get the the, the stealth one. Wait, do I already have? Oh yeah, that's the one I want. Damn.
I have any uh, like new item nonsense. Threw away that purple one. I could have kept it. Just sold it. Purple one. All right. So now when I use uh, when I petrify people, they'll they'll knock more than just one. It'll hit whoever's in the area around them. I've never seen a sword like it. The traffic is stuck. Who's that? Revenue. These spells are so Batman y. Like. <laughs> Wizard kind will submit to us once the war is over. The traffic is too tight. Ninja. I heard you like touch your microphone. Mm? I heard you like touch your microphone. I had no idea you were in. I don't even know what the is. Why are you so quiet? Am I quiet? Maybe. Am I still quiet though? Not as quiet. But like, how quiet am I? I don't know how you would measure that. Uh, how you measure it is, um, I need you to have a scale, okay, like a, like a chart, okay, and I need you to, like, if 1 to 10, 10 being the loudest thing ever and 1 being the loudest thing ever. Go. Um, 600. Oh, okay, so I'm, I actually, you can't even hear me at all. Oh, yeah, no, not at all. Okay. We make a good team. We do at that. <sighs> what are you playing, bro? Oh. I just got on Hogwarts. Oh, dog, Hogwarts. Man, that game ain't even good, Once bro. Again, we can fight our way yes. through. Or be discreet. Right. Yeah, exactly, bro. Oh, by the way, the stream can hear you now. I set it up where they can hear you. Aww. Perhaps we can find an Aww. alternate route up ahead. I can't be reckless anymore. Oh. oh, dang. There's a lot of them here. There's somebody there. Put your fingers to tell us. What was that? Hmm, run. Someone there. Damn. What? Screw's just hitting cars on purpose. <laughs> oh, that video over in the parking lot? Yeah. You're actually crazy, man. Damn, I just did this spell and all the voices are gone. <laughs> all the voices in your head? Yeah. Okay. All the voices are gone. And the fun is over. Fun is a relative term. Why would I go over there? I'm so used. Oh wait, is there a way over here? Oh, bro, Yeah. 
Oh, there's like this whole thing over here. I uh. have uh -huh, free chest. Mm. I should mean like not be able to get back in it now. I don't oh know my god, I can't. Oh. What? <laughs> Why the fuck can you jump over that? That makes no sense. Weird game, weird game. It's okay. I can climb right here though. Suey! Okay. Bro, um, I've I not that chest, that chest don't matter. Now, bro. now I'm only missing one spell in the game, bro. It's a curse, man. You're, You're a curse. Anyone, oh, dude, I am. Better or for worse, we're in. You should know better than that by now. We've all told you. Dude, I want to do valid. Don't listen. I want to fart myself in the face. You want to rage so bad. Hello. Bro, you want to go do guided beta? <laughs> accidents were reported. Guided gameplay, bro. The like guided beta. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. Um. Oh wait. I think it's gonna want me to go over there. What the fuck? I don't even know how that. Oh, there's just. Wait. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Shit, that jump was dope. <laughs> it's cool how your dude can climb. That's like the coolest physic in this game. Woo! I get it now. Disgusting for even a spider. This way, and then do I pull? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, that's how that works. Oh. Oh. Uh -huh. What the fuck? That's weird. I will make you. Wee! Damn, I'm fell. Open the source me. I don't know what that was. I don't know what that was. This big ass chest. Got five winged wigan weld potions. Ooh, it's the wavy bridge. Definitely think there's something here they want. All right, so I gotta go up there, but we're not gonna go up there. Eat can fringo, bitch. So am I like mega quiet? I mean, I turned you up like a little. Hear you. Alright, here, hold on. Now you're making me- I gotta go to my screen. High. Hold on, make sure that Any I'm, ideas? like, loud. Oh, I sound- I sound good. Oh my god. Eat confringo beef. To be honest, I, just, so I can I probably- I, I'm gonna- I guess I'm not the switch now. But, like... Oh, and by the way, I'm back on my- my actual mic now, brother. Yeah, I can. You can tell that much. It's no wonder yeah. spiders give Fuck yeah, this bumps. mic was hella worth the money. Hairy legs. There's not that much of a difference, but it's like the bouginess, you know? Like, yeah, bro, once exactly. you. Yeah, It changes colors. Yeah. You never go broke. Yeah, bro, it changes colors. Yeah! It's not connected to my headset. I saw my headset one plugged in, though, because I like to be able to hear my own voice. So I'm not. Motherfucker just got his spelly armist on, bitch. Yeah, mama. Oh, I wish you did 1v1, bro. I'd hit you with, like, Incendium. And I ain't don't have your weapon anymore. Whoa, where the fuck you come from, big dog? Why is there spiders everywhere in goblins? Spiders and goblins are, like, the enemy in this game. That's just what it is. Repair Maybe, maybe that is why you're really quiet. It's because you're on your normal mic now. On stream, I sound fine, though, luckily. That's all that really matters. It's okay. I turned you up. Yo, this music's dope. Ooh, I'm like, find the boss. Ooh, that's a gassy spider. Leviosa. Oh wait, I'm I'm not even on my. Incendium. Confringo. 
You're level 30? You're trash! Oh, no. Damn! Yo, fighting in this game is dope. It's like a really easy version of Batman. I like how like, Spelling Arms does a lot of damage. Even though it doesn't really make sense. It's how you get uh, Bombarda or whatever. The like, fuck especially if this guy doesn't have a weapon. <laughs> Bro, there's literally a spell bombarda where you literally shoot a bomb out of your wand. Basically. Fuck the motherfucker, just threw a bomb at me. Yeah, that We're one. Making quick work of them. Professor, Do I just block it. Okay, well, Ramrock's loyalist. I got marketed on. I, I, I don't really know how I feel about it. Ow, what the fuck? He has a turret. Okay, wait. Well, can't block it. Coming around here for the devil's death. I know you can walk through it without. Oh, that's what I'm supposed to. I got it now. Okay. Lumos. I'm gonna put this back on then. Lumos. And then. I'll just put that as that. I killed him. Seen a single rune symbol. I think we're going to be a bit distracted from runes for a moment. We have another fight on our hands. Why am I not surprised? Try to get down, get the chest. This chest. My gear slots are full again. How? Why do I have so many scars? <laughs> For what? Destroy that one. Good this man. Destroy that one too. Who likes that one? No one. Get real. Not a garb. Is it really that word? Damn, looks crying and it's a statue. How do you do that? Oh, okay. I love like launching them away from me and then launching and like bringing them back. What the shit? So they're like, we're not finished yet. Incendio. I can't dodge because I'm on the ground. Incendio. I got the spider to fix the low spike. Oh, I did. I missed doing it. Accio. Repulsor. Confringo. Accio. Incendio. Confringo. Here, 
certainly cleared the room. You're not a bad chap for a Slytherin. You Gryffindors don't have a monopoly on bravery, you know. A rune symbol above the cavern door. Ranrock's loyalists never knew to look for it. Confringo! Where's that for, though? Wasn't expecting that. Accio! Wingardium Leviosa! I didn't even know I was supposed to go here, but I went here anyways. And it was fine. See, when I'm going somewhere and I feel like I'm going the right way, I always go down the other corridor. That's my that's my thing, bro. Trying to find out all I can find. But since you're technically a burglar in this game. What do you have there? A journal entry by Isadora. Hopefully it will help us unravel more of this mystery. I'm almost level 30. Hopefully I can get level 30 before dinner's done. Hey. <coughs> Revelio. Sebastian, I think I found something. A canvas piece. Brilliant. Our efforts weren't in vain after all. Still. Something about this place um, is odd. If the triptych led us here to find this bit of canvas, <coughs> we can probably assume that Isadora Morganark was here. She seems to have been everywhere. But if she was using the Undercroft, and the cellar beneath her manor in Feldcroft, why would she create this space? And why hide it behind cryptic rune symbols? And ancient magic that no one but you could see? Isadora and Percival Rackham, another of the Keepers, could see traces of ancient magic too. Rackham? I haven't heard his name before. Here's a some <laughs> of the memories I've seen. By the way, Ninja... I don't think he and Isadora saw right to eye on how this magic should be used. That's how I'm feeling right now. This is all I don't actually baffling. know if he's evil, but that boy... Let's take the there. canvas back to the triptych. Perhaps the answers oh. are there. He got that energy, you know? Oh, sure. yeah, bro. For sure. I'm fascinated by it. I turned you up to 200% and you sound... Barely normal. Did. And that was kind of loud. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> it has to fit. <laughs> no, like... Actually, no, it's normal. It's so weird. Bro, well, I'm, so, I'm not like talking at full volume at all times. The good news uh, is I do, in fact. Maybe the there's something wrong with my Discord settings with this mic. Trouble. Tell you what I got on. I got voice activated. Automatically determine endpoint sensitivity. Input sensitivity. Did I turn that off? Do I sound normal now? Ah. I mean, you sound normal the whole time, cause like two hundred percent, you know. Ah, oh, dog. Come on, man. Wait, where am I? Wait. I had you at ninety percent before. Oh. That's why it's crazy. I know I that. I have coast. you at. Uh, taken over a huge idiot. mine in the surrounding area. Marin Weem has suffered for it. Uh, 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 what has Feldcroft's become? Should we head there now? We I just want to fight people. Why? All this time, we've been a step well, behind. Been woods and go find a level 30. I may know someone who could help us get Bro, ahead. this is Three why times. Elden Ring's better. Yeah, I'm not going to argue that because I do love that game too. It's just because, like, you just do your own thing. It's because you can just, you just do your own thing, you know? Uh, no main mission. Kind of but you just, it's more story driven, obviously. And not heard. You just you get there, you know? You just do, do, goblins do, goblins do pop your shit, queen. Have you get to the city and then the lady's like, thank you for bringing me here, like, I asked, and you're like, wait, you went through? No, Sebastian, I haven't. Like, huh? You're not listening to me. Why then you get to the mountaintop so and you're so like, ignorant. You asked me to bring you here too? <laughs> I was paying attention. Uh, Perhaps your uncle was right about you. Wait, I want to say my quote. I have three main ones? I Damn. Stop. So I can get 
unbelievable. I already have the pull, so. Alahamora. Oh, that's the one where you lockpick, and then. I'm gonna do that one, and then I'm just gonna go run around and shoot things. I had dual Sebastian right now. I wanna duel this dude. Austin, we must discuss. Discuss the terms of what, Misty? I don't know. Oh, dog. Hey, by the way, Austin, I'm live. Hi, stream. Not like he's gonna say anything. He's too also, scared. Also, if you a Prime sub, it's always free. Don't forget to use it. It's There's no harm, and you can always use your sub on someone later. Hey, oh my god. I do that for everyone's stream as well, bro. What I mean, while I'm streaming, I'm just Finally, preaching. Next <laughs> Even more oh, like, it is free. It's free. So it's the harm in it. And they're supporting a small streamer. Literally. If they don't use it, they're technically wasting $5 a month. You know what I'm saying? That is true. Technically, because they could just... Yeah, and you also get, like, emo. And no yeah. ads. Which all, everyone who watches me that I know is like, why do you have ads? <laughs> they just give you ads. I don't know. I didn't do that. <laughs> I didn't do that. Bro, I think I'm a sub to my favorite streamer, EGSF. Bro, I sort of... I don't subscribe to your favorite streamer, bro, EGSF, what if bro. I, he hasn't gone live in two years. Bro, what if I subscribe to EGSF? Bro, the last time he went live was two years ago. <laughs> Free money now. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if you get money. Unless no, I don't affiliated. get money. I, well, I mean, I am, but like, I don't get money from it. This may sound presumptuous, but you like me to report back with even more flight details. Why had to pay for my <laughs> you broom know me upgrade? Well. I feel I'm almost there. I just think I can improve broom flight. I'm gonna share that. Miss Ray is running a the room upgrade. The South Coast course. Not room upgrade. Deal, really. What with rumors of Ranrock's oh, lot broom. Your room. Oh, you <gasps> hey, I get props to everyone, but this right. dude, don't get props to I think. <laughs> no, <just> <laughs> <laughs> hey, I don't appreciate that prime stuff. <laughs> Damn, how do you get louder? <laughs> Settle down, big dog. Damn. Uh, look, I got louder because I told <laughs> He went to his mic. <laughs> <laughs> I got to my mic. I grabbed it, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I don't care about you, Gladwin Moon. Just hey, give me my mission. Thank you, Pluto. Oh, Pluto. He's actually hurt. Yeah, I actually think that's that's a him hurt right there. He is hurt. Hammer. Hammer. Wow, that is that a word actually? Hammer. Like, he's hammer than you. -E he's hammer than you. I'm not worried. Okay, guys, now I got yeah. food. Four and six. Okay, so um, okay, so four and one. Wait, zero, one, two. Okay, zero. So it's the owl. Okay. If you carry the eighty-four. There's an album coming out tomorrow. Perhaps I could test out. What? Six. So I need five. One, two. Wait, zero, one, two, three, four, five. I need crab. Give me crab. What the fuck is this thing? Where is it? Revelia. It's under me, you. F <laughs> Dude, this game actually looks fun. Yeah, For no it's reason. So fun. It, it I would is, devour this game. It, it's fun just because I like. Yeah, like I, I needed a game where I could just like get on and just like do what I want in general. Mm -hmm. Like it just, it's fun. I mean, it's not like Elden Ring. Yeah. Like you know, saying how you could literally just go anywhere. And this, you can't kind of do that. It is story driven, but like. It's still good. You still do what you want while doing the story. Yeah, it's way too sad, what do you like tell? I don't even know what this guy's talking about. Hmm. Dang. This map is massive. Oh yeah, dude. Dude, walking this would be stupid. <laughs> <laughs> oh uh, no. I actually might do that just to see. It is ridiculous. Like, that would be around. that would be a banger YouTube video. Bro, I I glitched take... him. Now he's stuck. Dude, it might take like an hour and a half or something, bro, to walk it, like to on foot run. This looks it might take like an hour, bro. It's huge. That would that would take longer than an hour, would. No, I it made this guy stuck. Sure. Hour minimum. Like if you know no. exactly your route and everything. But that would be a no. video. Days, because, you know, it just like five foot one. Hey. How I spent one hundred hours crossing the Hogwarts oh, map. Hey, that's a hey. Have you even played the campaign yet? Just just walk <laughs> the map. And then you have the castle too. 
Which oh, I was gonna restart the mission. It's not, as, it, it's not, I mean, yeah, it's big. But I, guess. Uh, I forget. I need to watch the movies again. Dude, I, I wish I did watch them before this, but. Oh, you didn't? Uh, because, dude, last year I watched them the all. Looks rather deserted. And I, I said to myself, right. next time I watch them, I, I want to watch all here. seven in a row or all eight in a row. Oh, and that that's was like 19 so and a half hours. What? I, I just haven't done it to watch all eight is it? and a half. Yeah. Are there like three hours each? I'm a tripping. Castle, isn't it? Obviously. Some of them are two. Evidently two, five. Oh, I don't think any of them are three. Maybe five? Pathetic. Five they hours? Begging me no, to like the oh, oh, I was, I was like, I don't remember this. I'm surprised yeah, our new They're all about an hour and a half, up. and then the last one's seven hours, bro. I suppose I appreciate no. the effort. That's actually, thank you. I know I can. Part of the rings, though, those are long. Get frustrated you watch the by those who don't take things as seriously cut as I ones, do. For the extended versions. And in my experience, that's mm -hmm. everyone. There's three movies and they're 12 hours. <laughs> anyway, don't let it go to your head. Right they're then. They're all four, I think. Four. We'll soon see how I fare, won't we? <laughs> I don't even know what she was telling me. I think she was scared for my life. I don't know what she was talking about, though. Hopefully I can do this. I haven't failed one of these yet. Okay, I'm so confused. Oh. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Eric Dio has a Valorant team. <laughs> Dude, I just completely choked because I forgot you turn with your left stick and you go up and down with your right stick. What is <laughs> what? wrong with me? I just completely choked that whole. Thing. Oh, it's like inverted controls. It, but it's inverted, but like it, you use both sticks to steer. Hmm? It's so whack. It is unbelievably whack. Hey, on keyboard though, it's worse. On keyboard, mm. you you steer. You don't use your mouse. Which what? is how it should be. You should use your mouse. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Uh, but it's like well. space is up, control is down. What? What? Uh, and then it's like left and right with the uh, 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 A and B, I think. That's so weird. Yeah, man. I don't know what they were thinking. Thank God Quidditch isn't in this game. I do not Hello, know. Hello, Morica. Imagine that, like competitive Quidditch. Oh, my. Dear. Playing on. Oh, my God. That'd be hilarious. Actually being on a team? Hey, <laughs> dude. <laughs> <laughs> that would be crazy. Oh my god. Bro, phase Quidditch. Oh, Made it. Phase up. Phase has a <laughs> sim racing team now. They do? Yeah, they picked up Crim6 for it. Oh, wow. Rotating it out until both corresponding gears are activated. These sports are so funny sometimes. Lot. Like, oh. you could have a phase Minecraft team. That'd be so funny. <laughs> dude, that would be sick. Optic, like that, that, Optic that was breeze. on that shit like 10 years ago. That was like a big thing for Optic. Minecraft? Yeah. Oh, dude. Really? Yeah. Yeah. What'd they do? Like uh, Hunger they Games? Did, like, um, on the that island. Wasn't too difficult. I, 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 it's like uh, one person would be like hunting them all down. And then they, huh? they did like a bunch of like weird games from back in the day. Like one of them was like, um, that one was the funniest one, I think. Oh, mm -hmm. those were underneath the bridge. Um,. But, uh, yeah, they did. A, they actually played a lot. That's when Optic really grew because they were big in, like, Call of Duty. Well, and stuff that's like how that works. Yeah. But it wasn't it, it wasn't after Minecraft. Like, they even had Optic Minecraft logos. Pretty flying, if I do say so myself. They the did? was all blocky. Yeah, dude, those shirts went so hard. I never had one, though. Do you well, know if they still sell them? I'm gonna look that up. Optic you Minecraft. Could probably get them still. Like, that sounds there. crazy. <sighs> Did anyone else see that? <laughs> they, I forget. They could just put optic logos on their shirts. <laughs> I'm so confused. Mine, they had a... Uh, Dashy was on the team. It's crazy. Dashy's on right now, man. He's on the Minecraft team. Dude, yeah, bro. What? Nate Shot was on the Minecraft team? Oh, yeah, dude. Uh, optic what? gaming. Oh, dude, Scump. Uh, I think Compass Minecraft on the Minecraft or, team. Uh, Hex. Uh, they they had everybody. Pomage. They, had a whole they bunch did. Of motherfuckers. Yeah. Oh I my can't God. find any of these shirts. Uh, they still wear them though. Actually. Yeah, they do. Guys, yeah, you'll see. You'll sometimes catch like Hex in them. And, mm. Yeah, man. No. All right. Oh, well, that's done. That was easy. I still have not that was failed quite a something. 
a, like a broom. Impressive work race. today, but so don't get too comfortable. I'll be on your heels easy. in no time. My family's not going to believe the news when I tell them. They're almost as competitive as I am. Almost. So disgusting time? What? Oh, I it's said that because it would just make you join because it was interesting. It, it was. Glad you're here. Mm -hmm. Fifth year. <laughs> Not bad for a Gryffindor. Everyone you being like kind of douchey yourself. that I'm a Gryffindor. I just got told I'm not bad for a Gryffindor. I should let Mr. Weeks know that this was his best upgrade yet. No, NPC doors. Or NPC doors, you know. Yeah. Alright, uh, what are we doing here? <sighs> Guys, I want me to travel so far. Ninja, what are you doing right now? Unlocking a bunch of doors. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Like I told you, the first time I did it, I didn't know what I was doing, and I just was spinning them back and forth. <laughs> <laughs> Wild as fuck. My favorite test flyer. Uh, hey, I have to talk to you, my guy. Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you again. Oh my God, that's a level 14, 32 defense. Oh my God, a level what? 32 Hello, what? But the weeks. Level 14, 32 defense. Fantastic. Your broom performed well then. The best upgrade yet. It flew beautifully, incredibly nimble. But with the speeds it now reaches, I can feel the wind catching beneath the seat a bit, preventing it from reaching its. I'll be level 15 for that. L. Could have anticipated that. Exactly the kind of report I've come to expect from you. At last, I think I know what needs to be done for my final upgrade. I shall look forward to speaking again. I'll be sure to send you an hour when I'm finished. Thank you. Can I knock this person out? I can't. This is so dumb. I'm gonna cry. Good for Mr. Week. Can, can I make you go upstairs? Go upstairs. Oh. I'm gonna go do all my side. Bitch, go upstairs. I am 50% done with everything in the game. It is. Alright, so 13 and 5. And the spider is 8. 85 is 13, so 0. Okay. Second one is that one, which is 2. 3 and 2 is 5, so 9. 9 is whatever the fuck that is. You're okay. back. Nice to see you again. Dude, I'm just like that. Honey. Dude, I really should have sold all my gear. Wait, why? There's so many. There's so much gear that you pick up for no reason. Yeah, I only Thanks sell, like, I hope to see you again. blues and higher. At my point in the game, I don't sell greens. I just delete greens and blues. Sometimes I sell Rare. Green is still free money. Sometimes it's it is, but I'm not gonna meat. just like mid dungeon fly to Hogsmeade and sell some stuff. Doesn't seem. <laughs> it seems too far away, man. Dude. This gear needs to go away. Austin! Ah, oh, yeah, mm hmm. Are, are you four digits yet in Osu? Not even five. Oh, why not? Because I'm terrible. Oh. I could get five, though. <laughs> Six, I'm terrible. <laughs> if I play the game for another week, I'll get, I'll get five digits. 
I five did you your face. But four did you start with like another dimension, bro? Dude, I got like the coolest uniform ever. What are you playing? Are you also playing Hogwarts? Yeah. You bought it? Yep. I am always careful, my Stole it from Kate. Precisely. She sent me an owl. Oh, was it, um. I got the gothic attire. It's like the coolest uniform in the game. I'm in the starry attire with an asylum mask. Ow. Pretty cool hat. My cape has stars underneath it. It's all dark. I'm in like a black suit kind of thing. If someone had medals in Matabilaland, father would still be with us. I must get to class. Perhaps your friend can get you to listen to reason. So frustrating. She never. Yeah, if I get one top play, I get five digit probably. Is that a term of endearment where you're from? So much should I go to tell her real quick? For I am the unusual creature in Hogsmeade. She mentioned. Who's calling not taught at Hogwarts. So I am gently Hello? discouraged from practicing it. However, I am an Animagus. And it is in my gazelle form that I have I been able to work guys freely until now. Moon. Much to my mother's chagrin. That is how I managed to spy on Rookwood and Harlow. Now the nickname makes sense. What an extraordinary ability to have. It is. I love transforming, but Mother is less enthusiastic about it. She says that no creature, especially one as rare as a gazelle, should be bounding about where poaching has become so prevalent. She claims that she has foreseen tragedy befall me in my gazelle form. But she has used her sight to control me too many times. I no longer believe it. We're making good. Hebe, 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 he, helpful puff this season. I have never considered quitting, even for a lot. You could have fled the moment you discovered that Rookwood, Hollow, and Randrock were after you. But you did not. If I was a helpful puff, I'd be. I must deal with Rookwood and Hollow, not I don't know what I'd be doing. I'd be crucioing right now. I don't know where I am all the time. Trying to get into Askaban real quick. Being here during that rather awkward conversation. You know. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. All right, now what do I gotta do? What am I doing? Mm hmm. I don't want to go do this. Oh my god. I don't know I'm gonna be your hope. Why did it disappear right there? This must be Aronshire. I'd best keep an eye out for spiders. Oh shit, I was, I was doing something on my computer. <laughs> Confinger! Even more aggressive than I'd expected. Incendio! Confinger! Incendio! Akio Incendio Capulso Don't you guys Akio. just love that sound? What sound? Incendio I don't know <laughs> I love it <laughs> Oh shit Oh that one Austin's my favorite daddy. Excuse me, little boy. Don't talk about that. <laughs> you call me little boy. 
Yeah, what about it? He's grown now, bro. He's body fun. Yeah, I prefer Sorry, a little I'm a big girl man. at this like... point. Oh my god, hi little girl. Hey. Yeah, no. yeah I'm just CBA. gonna sell my clothing. I just have seen a four minute map, how do you feel? Get I real. did that, actually. No, you didn't. No. Yeah, that I did. Me. No, that was mm, me. No, mm -mm. No, no. Negative. I'm better than you. I'm better than you. I would. A quaver. A DT. Oh, dog. Really? Mm hmm. Are you, like, for real now? I'm gonna go play Haji Kete, bro. Get real. Haji Kete! The fact you know that's kind of crazy. You can't die. That's not. Dude, I, I take part in. GTA, in that my... is. A GTA. I, I I take part in my Osu ness. In that if, this is to end. if that's a word, is that a word? Osu ness? Yeah. Earth. Yeah. Make it a word, bro. Ah, G K T. Too many, too many, too many, too many. Level three, man. You Hufflepuff. What? Not sure how it fare in a little place like this. <gasps> I got that. I got in, that one dude's glasses. Where like he has like an eyeball coming out of him. If this is where Mary bred the spiders, they're not here now. Maybe. Why is the music so epic? There's nothing going on. Wait, can I upgrade my broom? Oh, I can. Fuck it. Give me help. I'm gonna be as filled as the herb room. I don't know what that meant. Not sure I want to know where this leads. Am I racing again? I may find the little there. fighters in this game? Be insane to see them. Like the smallest one. Yeah. That's be insane. <laughs> Holy shit. I'd probably That's start crying. Yeah. If I'm being real. Let's get real. Of these yeah. before the situation gets even worse. <laughs> I hit the wrong one, and I got out of the course. Damn, I got a lot of quests now. Oh, I can get Defendo. Wee! Defendo! Wingardium Leviosa! Glossius? Glacius? W. That's all I know. W. Definitely going to Hot balloons over Pogmead Station. Hot balloons around the Quidditch pitch. Yeah. I don't know who hasn't gotten their broom. Austin. You haven't gotten their broom, Austin. What? Are you a Hufflepuff? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Are you gonna be the first Hufflepuff that uses Crucio, Austin? I already did. I have oh wait, for I'm real? Yeah, I'm that guy. Oh shit. This whole plan I've been telling you is just based on Austin's real life, bro. Get real. Austin. I, yep. Are we living in your world? Dude, we're just Austin? Playing the story about him. Uh, yeah. Damn. Austin, you're just that guy, huh? Yep. Yeah, by the end of this game, my character should be the strongest in the universe. Wizarding world. Voldemort won't have shit on me. No way. My favorite. That is my favorite. You can, I guess you can go pretty high. Can't go too high. I want to go through the door. 
I went through the door because I'm like that. I'm like that. That boy like that. I'm like that. I need the fifth one. And I can get glasses. Lacey eyes. Oh, it's right there. Oh, you, fucking, you freaking sprinkle snapple dab. I don't, I don't know. You're not supposed to question. Oh, thank God. And you can basically touch the ground with your broom. Yeah. 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 And that greenhouse is huge. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. kind of gay. Kind of gay. Bless yes. Glaciers! Pinfringo! Why I just wasted that on that one? I thought everything just auto scales to you, but no, I'm fighting like 29s and 25s at the same That's basically what I do. Level 14. Fucking it up. You know? I bought like a 27 when I was like 22, and it was insane actually. Not gonna lie, it was absolutely insane. Accurate. You're insane. Still didn't lose to it, but like, damn. The highest level I fought so far is a 24. That's the last of the spider sacks. It's a like a giant troll. Yeah. Kind of uh, do. Trolls are fun to fight actually. I, I enjoy. It. They remind me of like Elden Ring bosses, or like really weak versions of them. To be honest, you're an Elden Ring boss. I hope that's the last one. Not what I expected. If you time it correctly after you jump and you like roll, it's kind of like your dude's doing parkour. I'm gonna do it up here. Incendio. Hmm, it's roll. You're gonna break your ankles, kid. Learn how to roll. I'm just gonna go to the farthest place I can. I'm just gonna fly there. Uh, to go the actual furthest, I found this out because I just explored it. Uh, like on my own terms. Damn, and, I'm just gonna fly uh, one. You have to go through a cave. You have to go through like a mountainside cave to get to it. Mm. Like I'm just going to flag my. Right, the bottom no. right part, you have to go through a mountain. Oh, cool. Okay. Can't go over it, trust me, I tried. It is dope, though, not gonna lie. I like how far the map does reach. Like how far Austin reaches. Like eight foot. Right, Austin? No, oh, wait. Oh. That's the last one. Yeah! She's angry. You know what's funny? Is my mom and dad don't think I cuss. Okay, okay. Hey, what is the life? Hey, did they ever talk about Josh at all? Oh yeah, they hear him. Okay. I mean he plays by them, doesn't he or some shit? <laughs> like, <laughs> he plays like you no, know, we both play above them, but like I'm directly above them and he's like next to a large vent. Uh oh. Kinda of funny because my mom doesn't think I cuss. Hey, gang, gang, bro. <laughs> 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 
Mm. So foul. We. Revelio. Fucking go. Hardy K. Hardy Mate. Hardy. We. There's some giant spiders in this. Good, but not yeah. actually. Is enlightened. Okay. Oh, whoa! I found like a broke. Oh, it's like a town inside of a broken building. Oh, it's a camp. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna fight you guys. Actually, is. it's a camp. I don't care if you're level twenty. You ain't gonna do anything, big dog. You're already dead. You're dead before I what are you there. like? What the fuck did you just cast? Actually, I want the one where it brings him towards me. Because then I feel like it's just good. No! I assigned a wrong one. What's this one? Does it like, stop him? Oh, it does stop him. Oh. Hi. I just shit this 300 KP or 300 PP. Whoa. Don't do that next time. Oh, Bro! Have an answer for me about the butterfly. If I didn't miss that, I would have got three hundo. I have some news. Thank you. Grow. About my sweet friend Mary. Bro, there's a caffeine buff for real for real. I'm so sorry. Oh, I got a coffee Dunn. downstairs, I forgot. She was an innocent victim. Poor Mary. Fighting for the Hamlet to the bitter end, no doubt. And Wait, let me go up there. Let me go up. She truly let me cook. Ah! Let him cook. Remarkable. She didn't deserve this. Look what you've done. Shut up. I I'm like two years old. Your friend. I do. You'll be relieved to know that I cleared out the spiders. <laughs> get crazy. I don't even know what happened to you. I just know what happened. You cleared out the spiders. <gasps> Whoa. That man just got stabbed by lightning by the wrong dude. Business will be to help the Hamlet rebuild. I suppose I have nothing to fear from dead spiders. That's the spell. <laughs> Thank you again for all you've done. I shall be the Hamlet rebuilding. It's glad I could be of help. And I, I don't know why that's one, but it is. To dearly departed Mary. Ow, damn. I just love it. Oh my god. Hello, pardon me. Hello there. Was there something you needed? Hello. Shut up, lady. I was wondering Damn. if you would be interested in having your okay. own show. Oh, I just fought I level twenties. Mm. Penny's the name. Penny's an island boy. And Penny is most eager to start working. I with guess I'm kind of strong. It might surprise you to know that Penny can sell practically anything. <laughs> like, I didn't even notice me. I just summoned a, like, a lightning strike. Oh, wonderful. Oh, what up? Is that an ox? I don't know if you're an ox or a cow or a bull. You're one of them, I guess. If I go into a high area, I'm gonna get good loot. Got disarming. So rarely confides in her. Mm, however, she repeatedly mentions how tired she has become of trying to let the shop. She has had rotten bad luck with the last few tenants. <sighs> Are you all right? Are you holding your breath? <sighs> Penny's fine. Sometimes Penny simply needs to remind herself to stop talking. What kind of things would I be able to sell in the shop? All kinds. Anything from essence of Disney to moon carver. If a buyer exists for something, then Penny can sell it and get the best price. Just ask Mistress Mason.
<laughs> All right. I shall go and find Madame Mason. Oh, this is splendid news indeed. You won't be sorry. You can find Mistress Mason at her home on the north edge of the village. Penny does hope she gets to work with you. It's a bird. <laughs> Uh, Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Uh, Hello, Madam Mason. I understand you have a shop to sell. Why, yes. Yes, I do. Are you interested? Yes, I am. I've always wanted to own a shop. How yep. marvellous. <laughs> I think you will find my terms quite generous. But, and do please forgive me for asking, don't you think you might be a tad young to own a shop? I have a knack for this sort of thing, if I do say so myself. If I can meet your terms, I hope that you'll sell to me. Well, I reckon you have the confidence needed for such a venture. Of course, you'll have Penny to help you. That elf could sell tea to a troll. I assume she told you she comes with the place. She did indeed. I like you. Tell you what, I shall sell you the space for an exceedingly fair price. I think you might just be shrewd enough to make a go of it. Hmm. An exceedingly fair price for a shop and an elf. What's the catch? Huh? You are wise to be wary in business dealings. No catch, really. I simply ask that you allow me to do you the favor of buying the shop back. At a discount, of course, should your efforts fail. The last thing we need here in Hogsmeade is for one bad apple to spoil the barrel, if you get my meaning. Yes. An unsuccessful shop would be bad for nearby businesses, I'd imagine. Quick one, you are. Do we have a deal? The shop seems to be in an ideal location. Why has no one purchased it yet? It is indeed. But I've just decided to sell. I've grown weary of being a landlady. My late husband was the one with a passion for shopkeeping and business in general. You'd be wise to take advantage of this opportunity before the offers start rolling in. It looks to be rather a mess. Why haven't other tenants been able to make a go of it there? As you've no doubt considered, running a shop is not as simple as those less savvy might think. The new owner, however, will have something that previous tenants did not. The benefit of Penny's particular prowess. Her assistance will make all the difference, I should think, in both getting the shop ready for business and ensuring its success. It does sound intriguing, but I need to consider my finances first. I'll come and find you if I'm interested. Very well, but I won't... If you do want the shop, I'd advise you to return to me as soon as possible. Madam Mason, about the shop. Yes? I've decided I'd like to go ahead and purchase the shop. I have to say I'm impressed. You are a remarkably resourceful student. I am indeed. And brave. You won't be sorry. Give me the money, and I shall get the paperwork filed immediately. Wonderful. Shall I head directly to the shop? Please do. Oh, one more thing. Since my husband died, I've not been able to bring myself to retrieve some of his personal items. They're in a chest at the back of the shop. Penny has the key. As you get organized, I would be terribly grateful if you could help an old widow and gather his things for me before you open for business. 
I wish you the very best of luck in your endeavors. Penny will meet you there. This game has taken a turn, Ninja. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to hogs. I just bought a store, bro. So now I'm a store owner in Hogsmeade. What the fuck? I didn't expect this. I, I didn't know there was this many mechanics in the game. Well, I've done it, Penny. The shop is mine. Oh, Penny is so pleased. Penny was hoping you would be the one to purchase it. I'm glad you're here to help me. Goodness, what a kind thing to say. Penny will do all that she can to make this a success. There is much to do. The last tenant left in a bit of a rush, so we'll need to clean up and do some repairs. Well then, let's get to it. Penny is ready. Between the two of us, we should have this place up and running in no time. Repairer. Oh, Penny can already see the potential. Nothing like a bit of hard work. Mistress Mason wanted Penny to be sure and give you this key. It opens a chest in the back room of this shop. Oh, yes. She mentioned it to me. It contains some of her late husband's belongings. Penny wonders if you should open the chest. <sighs> Are you holding your breath again? Get back to work now. Yeah, I don't think I should. Huh? But the do it. Like it. I feel it. I feel like you're gonna just like learn the curses and kill everyone. Can't wait. Can't wait for my Hufflepuff. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Anvil. Levioso. That's odd. Why would someone store one hat in here? Revelio. Incendio. Incendio. Oh, that's not very hospitable. Confringo. Oh, goody! Someone to play with. You seem brave, I think I've been abducted. This will be. For me, at least. Yeah, phone call again. Here, I'll be back. I'm about to go eat stream. I will be back. I'll be back, dog.
What? Who puts mustard on what? Just straight pickles by themselves? I don't know, man. That sounds... It doesn't sound that bad, actually. But then again, I fucks with pickles heavy, bro. So... But why are you guys talking about that, though? So random. Not a completely different. I bet you can find it. It's out there. There's someone's done it. Taylor Swift over a ye. Oh, did not think this one through. Lumos. Revelio. Confringo. That's new. Onwards, I suppose. What in the... Who's there? Confringo! Lumos. Seems as if I should hang something there. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. These lanterns must belong somewhere. How enlightening! You might survive a bit longer than the other. Lumos.
Oh, you've come so far, so quickly. Well done. You might be just the playmate I've been looking for. I do hope you enjoy my playground. I encourage you to tell everyone about it. If you make it out, that is. Please try. <coughs> if you get to the end, perhaps we can come gotcha, to some yep. sort of arrangement. I do want your shop to succeed, after all. What's the saying? Two sides to every storm. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, both. Uh, and that's him, bro. My story! And you'll have to complete both to get to the end. Confringo! I simply adore this blooming place. Don't you? You know, foliage, like most living things, won't survive for long in the dark. The Pulso! Confringo! 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 Oh, I'm afraid of the dark! Akio! Don't you know that I can see you, but you can't see me. It should. I'd offer you a seat, Lumos. but I'm rearranging the furniture. Plus, don't want you getting too comfortable once in the store. Confringo! Accio! Wingardium Leviosa! Confringo! Revelio! Uh. Accio! Wingardium Leviosa! Lumos. Ah, a worthy playmate. Well done, me. Confringo, incendio. Incendio. Confringo. Incendio. Capulso. Accio. 
Lumos. Incendium. Lumos. Accio. Ingardium Leviosa. In Guardium Leviosa. What's this? What she is. That was the wrong square. Chess pieces on the board indicate where I can't go. Perhaps I can find a way to reveal the path. Revelio. That wasn't too difficult. Oh, goodness! <laughs> I do hope you're having as much fun as me. I think I'll keep you around a bit longer. Accio! Wingardium Leviosa. Ingardium Leviosa. Now that should get your attention. Well, this has been fun. Much to do, much to do. See you in a bit. Just mean they. <laughs> Lumos. 
You need more than you've learned from books to best me. It's always good to have a different perspective on things. In Guardian Leviosa. So much fun to be had. My head is. Oh, right, there we go. Now I'm actually up. Lumos. I just need it. Levioso. Well, I forgot I'm not on those. Tunfringo. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. Back now. Oh, I didn't even see this hand right here. Dude, this place might be the coolest place so far. Lumos. Perhaps I should keep the lantern into this room to cause the room to rotate again. I don't like how they kind of like give it to you like that. All books and Accio. no pay make one from Guardian Leviosa. Lumos. <laughs> Revelio. Lumos. Oh, deja vu. What <laughs> I already knew. I see. Lumos. Oh, well, actually, I'm gonna break everything now. 
Oh, it's the half. Lumos. Lumos. Running in circles, are we? Perhaps you should retrace your steps. We shouldn't have lit. What was that? Levioso, Lumos. Fighter. Rebellio. Lumos. Confringo. Lumos. Lumos. I can't see anything in it. Okay. Or this. Oh, how nice of him to Blue pop it. That's not what I meant to do. Akio. Lumos. Incendio. Confringo. Akio. Incendio. Confringo. Incendio. Lumos. Confringo. Holy crap. Lumos. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. Not too hard. Still isn't that difficult at all, to be honest with you. Alright. Do this shit. There's a, a giant mannequin, probably? Wasn't even like anything. Like what? A moment. I 
I thought it was gonna be a giant mannequin boss. Which would have been really sick, but. Worth opening. Lumos. This is awesome. Aha! Finally! You, my inordinately clever friend, appear to have traversed this seemingly never-ending dungeon relatively unscathed. And now I suppose you'll want to go. Everyone leaves me, usually in a straitjacket, never to return. I'm starting to take it personally. I'm tired of having no one to play with. Ooh. Ooh. Is you guys great? Tell you what, I'll make you a deal. If you can match wits with me now and agree to give me unfettered access to the shop for, say, one day a month to have a little fun. I'll sign a contract. Pursue it to which, um, uh, let me see, I will blah, 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 blah. Oh, yes, uh, leave you and your customers alone at all other times, etc., etc. You get to shop, I get my chaos. Sound acceptable? Excellent! <laughs> Let the games begin! Catch his cat can, but cat is cat. I know. You can't. Confringo. Akio. Incendio. Confringo. Okay, so then we can run that and that. Uh. Bombarder. Defender. It's literally a troll. It is a troll, yeah. Confringo. Bombarder. Incendio. Oh, too far. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to hit that. Spawned in a bunch of panicking guys with him. That's fine. Protego. Stupid. Confringo. Incendio. Seeing things from my point of view. Oh, no, I don't think I can do this, bro. Oh. Incendio. 
fought it all the way upside down. I understand why they did that. Bombarda, defender, confringo. That was crazy, actually. Well, well, finally. Someone deserving of the playground I so meticulously crafted. Such a treat to have fun again in my little dungeon. I must say, I enjoy a good challenge. Ah, a kindred, dare I say, spirit. So, about the contract. I am a poltergeist of my word. Very well. I shall agree to your contract with one small addendum. Hooray! No more of this Jesus. unsatisfying banging about all day in a pitiful void. Wait, did you say one small addendum? I did. In order that I have a successful shop with lots of customers, would you agree to causing chaos only after nine o'clock in the evening? Hmm. Hmm. Would you agree to at least two days a month instead of one? I would. Pleasure doing business with you. You've worn me out. Oh, well done. I have a feeling about it. I have to admit, Cassandra did a wonderful job finding the path up this playmate. All right, that dungeon was awesome and unexpected. That was that was probably one of the more fun things you could do in the game so far, as in dungeons. Hello, Penny. Oh, Penny, he's so glad you're back. You knew exactly where I was going when I entered that chest. Penny was beginning to think yet another shopkeeper was going to end up in St. Mungo's. Another shopkeeper? St. Mungo's? I think you should explain, Penny. <gasps> Penny, please stop holding your breath. Tell me what's going on. <sighs> oh, please forgive Penny. Penny is forbidden from telling you anything. But how can you be forbidden from telling me what's going on? I purchased this shop. I... Penny is confused. Penny thought that if you came back, you would own the shop. Thank you, Penny. I think I'm going to need to talk to the authorities. Oh, Penny is certain that's a brilliant idea. Officer Singer will know what to do. Penny will wait right here. Yeah, I, I would. I would, too. If I was fully abducted... I would do the same. By myself studying for a while. Officer Singer, I have some information you might be interested in. Ah, good to see you again. What can I do for you? Cassandra Mason sold me her shop and then tried to drive me mad in a haunted dungeon. I. Cassandra Mason sold you her shop. Well, yes, she said she did, but I think you might have missed the bit about the dungeon. No, no, I, I heard that bit too. And, according to the house elf that came with the shop, she has done this sort of thing before, repeatedly. Hmm, I wondered what was going on. She seems to have had a great deal of trouble keeping a tenant in that shop. In any event, these are serious accusations indeed. Perhaps a little visit with Cassandra is in order to clear this all up. Shall we? Is 
thinks it's got Where are the two of you headed? I shall see you there. There. Oh, they're snooping. Oh, hello, Rue. I see you've met my new tenant, Cassandra. It's my understanding that you sold your shop and your elf to this student. Now they've been telling me some very interesting stories about your business practices. Perhaps you should come with me. <laughs> Stop her! What's uh, going on here? Confringo! Uh, Bombarda! No! Oh, uh, Incendio! Confringo! Oh, that one I should have hit her with a curse right there. Confringo! Confringo! Defendo! Bombarda! I like this little battle arena actually. One on one is not like. I should have known better than to do business with a wily student. Send you. Oh, Defend oh, Bombarda. No. Confringo. Dude, just dolly whopper. Excuse for a fight. Truly. Stupid. Confringo. Bombarda. Um, this dude is so powerful already. I'm still just a student. What on earth are they teaching you at that school these days? Confringo! Bombarda! Confringo! Confringo. Protego! Oh. Stupid! <laughs> Incendio! Oh. Defender! Ah. Confringo! Oh. Oh, that was a dumb decision. Protego, stupid one. Oh! Confringo, oh, no! bombarder. Defender, oh! incendio. Oh! Such a sad excuse. Confringo! Dude, I'm like the strongest uh, wizard in this world already. I'm disappointed in you, Cassandra. Incarcerate! You don't know what you're doing! <sighs> don't I? I always wondered why you couldn't seem to keep a tenant in that shop of yours. I must admit, the notion of a haunted dungeon never crossed my mind. Thanks for this. You can head back to the shop. Checking that house elf of yours, she's probably terrified. Phony little traitor myself! I should have known it was- Silencio. I mean, that was cool. Oh, and not to worry. Cassandra will immediately file the paperwork needed to grant you ownership of both the shop and the elf. On her way to Azkaban. Thank you, Officer Singer. Best of luck to you as the newest shop owner in Hogsmeade. That was a dope transition, but damn. I've always said that travel. Oh, 
Oh, hey, no. I have what I hope will be good news. Officer Singer confirmed that ownership of the shop has now transferred to me. Oh, well, that is good news. Penny is so relieved. Penny had the most difficult time keeping the truth from you. Penny promises to work as hard as she can for such a kind new owner. <sighs> Penny, I found an item of clothing in the dungeon that I'd like to give you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Penny never thought she would be given clothing and become a free elf. It's my pleasure. You deserve it. Of course, Penny will be staying on and managing the shop for you. Penny, you're free. You can do anything you've ever wanted to. But all Penny has ever wanted to do is run a shop with a friend and sell to the villagers in Hogsmeade. If that's what you want to do, Penny, then nothing would make me happier. I'm genuinely glad you'll be staying on. Penny is too. All that's left is for you to choose a sign for your new shop and Penny will take care of the rest. That's kind of sound dope. Redwell and Brewster, no. Nah. Going with this one. I choose Vestas and Venom. Excellent choice. Have a look outside. Thank you. I shall work on collecting items for the shop's inventory. Oh, and Penny, we'll be closing the shop by nine o'clock every night. Hey. Right. That was a long mission. Holy crap. Go across this that dodge. You can. You, you can go off ledges. That one was just weird. Yeah, I forgot. All right, let's get on to the next quest. Are you ready to put an end to Halo? All right, let's do this. I'm ready to do what's needed to take Harlow down. I know you have a plan. We must gather information from the friends of Mr. Bickle that Archie and Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Agabus Filbert, Otto Dibble, and Mr. and Mrs. Rib. All right. I suggest that you speak with each of them while I head to the Hogshead. I saw some Ashwinders heading there. And as my mother would never go near the Hogshead, she is less likely to learn of my activities than if I were to wander the village questioning its residents. Very well. I'll speak with them, uh, see what I can do. This. I knew I could rely on you. We need to know how they are being blackmailed by Rookwood and Harlow. Meet me here after you have spoken with them. Hopefully, by the time you return, I will be able to move a bit more freely. <laughs> I will say stream, I'm probably going to be ending stream here in a little bit. Revelio. And then I'm going to be starting it back up. I'm going to take a little bit of a break coming up here soon. I'm going to try to get to 30 though for sure before I get off. I'm going for the wrong one. I think I passed a couple of them. Agabus Felbert must be around here somewhere. Hello there. Excuse me, Mr. Filbert. I wondered if I might speak with you about your dealings with Theophilus Harlow. I hope to ease Mrs. Bickle's mind by gathering evidence against him. Oh, tragic what happened to Bickle. He wanted me to speak out against Harlow for an act of violence committed against me. But I feared Harlow's retaliation, and so I refused. It 
If you had spoken out against him as Mr. Bickle asked, perhaps Harlow would be locked away by now. Perhaps. But... <sighs> perhaps I would have suffered a similar fate. You said that Harlow committed an act of violence against you. Could you tell me what happened? Before my extraordinary wife, Dulcibella, passed away, she had just completed a small book of poetry. As a surprise for her birthday, one she never had the chance to celebrate, I had the book beautifully bound and plated in gold. One day, Harlow came calling to punish me for having spoken out against the Neanderthals that comprise Rookwood's lot. Before I knew it, I'd been petrified, and Harlow was rifling through my home. He found the book of poetry with its exquisite gold plating. I watched helplessly, lying there in my entranceway as he walked away with the book, laughing as he went. I was shaken to my core. Still am, to be honest. I imagine you fear Harlow retaliating again. But do you mind if I share this information with Officer Singer? <sighs> I suppose I have no choice. This extortion can't go on forever. You can pass it on to anyone who may be willing to help. Hey, that's Harlow huge news. Does not like people talking, as you already know. Now, to find Mr. Bickle's other two friends. <laughs> I actually like my outfit. My outfit is probably my favorite outfit in the game so far, other than the whatever it's called. I'm going. Other than the dark arts robe. What's a Dibble wants to Gladrax? I should check there. Yeah, but, 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 but please tell me you didn't. Take Mr. Dibble, may I speak with you? It's about Theophilus Harlow. I've nothing to say about him. Uh, may I interest you in a stunning cravat today? Please, sir. I'd like to help. I spoke to Mrs. Bickle. You know the Bickles? Mm, all right. But we must be discreet. Can't have Mr. Hill hearing this. I know Mr. Hill. He was kind to me the day of the troll attack. Oh, he's a good man. But even he wouldn't understand about Harlow. It started a few weeks ago. I was distracted, reading a note when you know who came into the shop. I hid the note behind the counter and offered to help him. He stared at me for a moment, then asked me to check on an order he'd placed. I went into the storeroom to check on what turned out to be a non-existent order. When I returned, he was holding the note. What was in the note? It was a note from Rosie Hill, Mr. Hill's daughter. You see, we've been, well, secretly engaged these past six months. We haven't told Mr. Hill yet. I dare say he has higher hopes for her. Harlow advised me in no uncertain terms that my relationship with Rosie, not to mention my employment here, depended upon my cooperation. What did he ask you to do? It all happened so quickly. In an instant, he took a very expensive scarf from the counter, pocketed it, and smiled. He said, your secret is safe as long as I can supply my lady friend with delightful items like this every so often. I've been able to cover for his requests until now with some creative bookkeeping, but I can't keep it out for much longer. I'm terrified to say anything. I could never live without Rosie. Thank you for telling me. I'm gathering evidence to take Harlow down. I would love nothing more than to see him rotting in Azkaban, but be careful. He's an awful man and incredibly dangerous. As for Rosie's letter, should you happen upon it, I have committed it to memory. You may destroy it immediately. Understood. Now hurry off before Mr. Hill returns. Where uh, was I? We're on the right track. Now to find the last of Mr. Bickle's friends. Give me that ability in real life. I'll fly around. Oh my lord. Mrs. Rape should be nearby. Actually, I'm not at this bar. I feel like this is where I would hang out. Oh, you know, my boys would all sit up at the Mrs. top, Rape. looking down upon everybody. I, I feel like. I might speak with you about Theophilus. We bars like this out here. I'm a friend of the Bickles, and I'm trying to gather evidence against him. Poor Joanna and little Archie, and now Harlow has taken my darling Isco. What do you mean? Why? <laughs> I'm a security guard at Gringotts. And my husband is a curse breaker for them. Harlow approached me about helping him extort my colleagues into giving him treasures from the vaults. 
And you declined? Of course I declined. Repeatedly. I thought they'd given up. Until I came home one night and found my husband gone. And a note affixed to my door with a knife. The note stated that I only had a few days to reconsider helping with some banking needs and that my husband would appreciate it if I acted quickly. But the help Harlow wants is help that I cannot give, and my dearest Isco is paying the price. Thank you, Mrs. Rabe. Knowing the lengths that Harlow will go to is helpful, albeit more than disturbing. Mr. Bickle was trying to help us, but now he's gone. I don't know what to do. I shall do all I can to get evidence against Harlow, Mrs. Rabe. Very well. Here's the note I received. You must be careful as well. Please don't put yourself in danger. All right. All right. Some evidence worth hanging on to. Thank you. Revelio. <sighs> I hope it's not too late. I've spoken with Mr. Bickle's friends. Now to find Natty. Hey, buddy. Lumos. I already came up here and I didn't grab that. Man, I was super. Yeah, I guess. Understandable, but damn. Let me go look at my collections real quick. I want to see the brooms I'm missing. They're all vendor brooms, too. I know where I can get one of them. Shopkeeper's coat. What? I can look like a shop. I mean, I own a shop now. That's cool. But like, what? I don't know what's going on. I was like, we can fight tonight or what? Here, let's see what the shopkeeper stuff looks like. Hold up, let me take all this off. Shopkeeper. Not bad. Actually, I thought it was gonna be the other outfit. It's not like that. 
Was he to be late? She said she was going to the hog's head. Perhaps I'll find her there. But he must be around here somewhere. Natty's wand. She can cast without it. She wanted me to find this. She's in trouble. Revelio will show me where she was taken. Revelio. Nosy little students get what's coming to them. <laughs> Natty must have been taken this way. I need to find her. A hideout's right here. I've been in this building before. What the hell? Augmented you. There must be another way forward. Akio. Oh yeah, I forgot you had to light. Hold on, dude. Hey, come on. Yo. Hidden door. Natty must have been taken this way. I need to find her quickly. I'd better be sure I'm not seen. Party on time. One thing to secure allegiance with one who has something to offer. A craftsman, so uh, to speak. Uh, but it's quite another. I may go to Hogsmeade later, stir up some trouble. They need to be reminded of what's that. Not especially quiet, are you? button to dodge. Incendio. Expulsive! Ah. 
Level 30! Let's go! Alright, um... Well, that first. And we'll decide where we're going. Okay, so... E. Uh, this is extra damage, right? Or no, this is where it goes through multiple people. That actually would not be that bad, because they do use it in combat. Uh, this also would be very nice. That is awesome. Oh, uh, I, I don't need. That might be one of the last ones. Like, if I remain done for longer periods of time, that would be really good. And so is that. As input. That also is really good. Go with this one. Sorry, I've been using a lot of stupefy, so like that works out for me. I'm not gonna go. Rebellion. Revelio Find this goddamn love letter. I'm gonna find it. Found the other one on complete accident. That is the pink part on my screen. Otto Dibble's love letter from Rosie. He wanted me to destroy this if I found it. My guy destroy it? Where would it be? It wouldn't be an owl boat. Give me an option. So. Oh, wait. Uh, Akio. Akio. Guardian Leviosa. Akio. Guardian Leviosa. Lumos. See what's in here. Might as well. Revelio Lumos Revelio Help. 
Mr. Rape. Daisy told me you'd been abducted. She spoke with my wife. How is she? Worried about you. Are you all right? I am all right. Thank you for coming. These locks are cursed, and there's an anti-apparition jinx on the cells. Even Natty's skill with wandless magic cannot free us. I need you to find my wand. Use mine. I'll find yours together once you're out of there. I need my wand for this. Using one with which I have no connection may not work as well or as quickly, and we cannot risk detection. I shall do my best. Any idea where it might be? It's nearby. I can sense it. Understood. You can sense I'll a wand? It. Your friend Natty was not able to summon my wand. It must be blocked by something. Revelio. Confringo. Incendio. My wand is somewhere in this room. I can tell. Revelio. Confringo. Incendio. Confringo. Lumos. Mr. Rabe's wand could be in there. Levioso. <laughs> Defendo. Revelio. Alohomora. What the hell? Natty couldn't summon Mr. Rabe's wand from her cell. Mr. Rabe's wand? He'll be glad to have this back. Mr. Rabe, I found your wand. Well done. I knew it was nearby. Now, you best stand back. One never knows how a curse will react to being broken. Thank you, Mr. Isco. My pleasure. Wild. And thank you, my friend. We owe our lives to your bravery. I may be too weak to disapparate with you both, but I can try. You go ahead. Find Officer Singer. We will get out of here on our own. Very well. But be careful. Thank you, my young friends. Be prepared for a fight. These Ashwinders must pay. I mean, I beat them all up, though. Wrong way. Got how to get out of here. You do just straight up. Lumos. Lumos. Go this way. That's the group. Let's find Officer Singer and put an end to Harlow. Chicken wild. Oh, she's here already. Wow. Natsai Onai. I should have known. And you, the troll dispatcher. Oh, thank goodness the two of you are safe. Isco Rabe told me a couple of students had rescued him. Should have known it was you two. Is Mr. Rabel right? He is. I sent him home to his wife. Miss Onai, your mother will not be pleased to learn that you're still risking your safety pursuing these dangerous men. Actually, Officer Singer, Natty and I learned of several Hogsmeade residents who've had their lives threatened by the Ashfinders. In addition to abducting Mr. Rabe to blackmail his wife and Natty, Rookwood and Harlow have also extorted Agabus Filbert and Otto Dibble. Ah. Uh. I will look into all of that. 
As for the two of you, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but you are taking great risk. Next time, please let the authorities handle the Ashwinders. With all due respect, officer, the authorities haven't done much about any of this. There's more to taking down an organization like the Ashwinders than simply storming in and hauling them off based on a few accusations. I must insist that you leave them to us. We shall have no further discussion on this. Natsai, er. you may wish to speak with your mother about this before I do. My mother will not like this. Thank you again for rescuing me. We shall speak soon. All right. That's another one done right there. Is that part of the main quest? No, it's not. That's part of one of these. All right. This. God damn. I am in town, it's like... Where's okay. my store at again? Your doing. Thank you from me and Rosie. Alohomora. We're just leaving for our honeymoon after we tell Mr. Hill of our recent marriage. Wish me luck. Of course, it's right there at the very end. Rebellious. Really hoping to just find a demi guys. I know there's probably not one in here, but well, now demi guys. Oh, there is! Thank God. Break into people's house is problem. I like this little. Incendio. Really, you can't light that up. Hello, Hamora. Been down this block or something? Okay. Out. There's another one. You guys would be really. Revelio. to see you back here oh perhaps today you have something you'd like penny to sell for you Thing on elden ring oh uh, yeah be fun oh penny will fetch a good price for what you'd like to sell i get better prices giving them to her than i do actually selling them Wishes you safe and wondrous travels. 
That's awesome. Oh god, I don't want to go back in there. Yeah, but I can help you with it. That's Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Got it downloaded. Oh, it's a dragon egg. Let's do this. Uh, any, you know, tell me what it kind of is. So I like kind of know. Like I what incantation is it? Is it a seal? It what is it? Post office. Graham told me to expect a package, but it looks as if she forgot to send it. She didn't send me an owl this week either. Perhaps she's busy with her research. What did you find out about the dragon you were tracking? I realized that she didn't know the poacher. Otherwise, you can tell me later when we're on. So when she left Horntail Hall, she would have headed straight to her nest. I went back to the tent and tracked her flight. Well done. You certainly know what you're doing. I can't be certain, but I have an idea of one place she may have been heading. I thought we might go and see it for ourselves. Of course. Shall we leave now? If that's all right. I want to see how she's faring if she had a collar on. And she's likely frantic about her egg. Where is it? I'm not down with all this, but like... Right. Here we are. I do think this is where we'll find her. The terrain's typical of where the breed would nest. I suspect it's how the poachers found her to begin with. They likely camped here and logged her patterns. Perhaps nabbed her first and then her egg. Dragons are hard enough to wrangle, let alone maternal ones. You got all of that from simply standing here? You'd be surprised how easy it is to think like a poacher. Shall we see if she's home? We only need to return her egg. Oh yeah, there's a couple of those. There's two of them. That sounds straightforward enough. We should be in and out. Then we can be finished with the poachers once and for all. There's one you can already go to. It's in uh, Kaled. Uh, Church of Dragon Communion. Well then, let's find our dragon and return her egg. Wonderful. If she sees us flying about, she might take it as a sign of aggression or food. We should stay on foot. Oh, and one more thing. Let's not agitate her. Goodness knows she's been through enough already. I'm ready when you are. There she is, above us. She could make it to Well, good. It looks as if she wasn't collared like the other dragons. That's a dragon. Poor thing must be worried sick, wondering what happened to her egg. For what it's worth, she doesn't seem to have spotted us yet. Confringo! Defendo! Incendio! Glacier! I wonder how many they brought to capture. At least ten, usually. again she's breathtaking from a distance you guys just carrying a book I how good her eyesight is I beg your pardon I don't imagine the poachers fed her well and from a distance we probably look exactly like sheep to her how oh, lucky for us. Watch your step. Pity. She must have been starved to pick 
Or just raring. Yeah. Incantations can't be powerful, especially if you use the right one. The the ice one is insane. Well, there's no Wait here. I'll run ahead. I'll draw her attention. Follow when it's safe. Welcome. It's a little too warm, if you ask me. I don't suppose she listened to reason. I normally try, but we're well past that. She's leaving quickly. Brilliant. Every bridge here broken. Repair her. I should just appear. Now, if we just return her egg, we can hopefully make it out without too much fuss. That's a little close to not dodge or anything. That was awesome. That was brilliant. And did you see how clever? She left us perfectly unharmed. Yeah, it is a game changer. It, uh, Creatures are a lot cleverer they, um, than most people realize. That's what Gran always says. The important thing is that we survived it. And we returned her egg. Thank you for doing this with me. Wouldn't blame you one bit if you wanted to head back to the castle and never think about dragons again. Shall we head back? I'm ready if you are. I am. After our dragon rescue at Hauntel Hall, I half expect to be ambushed by poachers any time I'm not in the castle. Understandable. We did sabotage their fighting ring and steal a dragon egg from them. True. True. So why haven't they come after us? It's not like them to let things lie. Unless... Unless what? Unless they haven't let things lie. Oh no, I can't believe I didn't see it. We need to leave. I need to send an owl. What is going on? How could I have been so blind? I don't enjoy. Oh, that's her.
to Hogsmeade. What am I even doing? I don't know. Wait, where is the... Is that in the map? Yeah, it's in the map chamber. I don't care. I'm not trying to do all that. I'm trying to do all these. Follow the butterflies. Let's do that. This might be the last quest I do on stream tonight. And we'll pick back up tomorrow with this game. I'll play, obviously, throughout the night, but I'm just not going to be... <laughs> there they are. She wasn't making it up. Well, we've come this far. Miss Willardsy might get an answer about these butterflies. Oh, I forgot this is how you go. We have here. I'm stuck in a tree. Here I come. Ugh. Oh, please tell me you have an answer for me about the butterflies. All right. Hello, Miss Willardsy. That was not the last thing we're doing because that was way too easy. That was like one minute. They led me into the forest and revealed a treasure. Oh, how lovely! I'm glad you were rewarded for your efforts. Oh, perhaps one day I'll be able to bring myself to go into the forest. For now, I'm happy simply knowing there's something so lovely to see, should I dare. Oh, that's done. Let's not pick up any more. Let's just finish more. Oh, these. Right. Do it. Hogwarts. Hark. How to get there? Oh, but what I was explaining was um, they are a game changer. They make it a lot easier because you have a duo to fight the you summon in for a boss. Revelio. 
There's the key. That's what these do? How do I get this key in there? Going on here. How are you supposed to do this? I'm just gonna keep smacking it. It's gonna take eighty eight years. Yes. That is the hardest door to unlock in the game. I don't care what anyone says. Coin. Perhaps Nelly knows what it means. That is unbelievably annoying. Right. I hear law. Better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Why oh, is there one right here? Revelio. Were you able to follow one of the Dedalian keys? Hello, Nelly. Hey. I managed to get a Dedalian key into its lock. Brilliant. What did you find in the cabinet? A curious token of some sort. Looks like a Gryffindor house token. I'd better unlock our house chest. I call them house chests. I've seen the one in our common room and heard there are also in the other common rooms. Keep an eye out. I do hope you continue on. For so much effort, the pie... Do I have to open up more of them? Obviously, is there like because I've seen like five other ones. This must. I should see this through and find the Gryffindor house chest. That's a lot. We count it: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. There's sixteen. All together, including mine. I could have just read the bottom of the screen. That's crazy. That's you got me messed up. I'm not doing all that, man. All of them? Last try. I mean, I've seen a bunch of them. I'm sure I can find more of them. All this stuff. What should it be marked on you? Wait, are they marked? Put on here. I'll do those when I run in. I actually walk on the couch in the yard looking for those. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Upright. Alohomora. Damn. Let me 
Levioso. Revelio. I think that was the one I was actually looking. Looks promising. This looks like the portrait from the map. And where's the treasure? Crazy. Like to shop in the house. Now I know this one on the stairs also I just don't know where it was. Revelio. Thomas Brown knows more about this. Akio. There was a doorway hidden within the portrait. I wonder what came of Arthur's search. I gotta see that one. That one actually looked really cool. That one's sick, actually. I'll, I'll use that when I go to mix up my outfit. Oh, right there. I didn't. I wasn't. I thought it was gonna go up and then over. I thought they all had the same pattern. Nope. You're actually hard to do. Oh my god, I thought it was gonna go. It went up even further. Revelio. At least I'll hear them now and I'll just face them. That is pretty awesome, to be honest. Off on another adventure, are we? Why do students always run when Peepy wants to have some fun? Very taxidermy to troll. Age. Last case. It is crazy that you can just explore this castle. Oh. oh, 
Oh, I did pass one. I was not paying attention. I ran right by this thing. Three, two, one, here. Brilliant. We out here. We out here finding them and not even know where the hell we're going. What's the last one now? Here in check. Revelio. One there. Maybe put one in the library. At least I would. And now those. Shuts up about you. Liar. I know you're lying. Tell me. All right, let's keep looking. By Merlin, I will no sooner tolerate foolishness than insolence. Neither makes for a knight worthy of esteem. Look like Gary Oldman. Revelio. Just for exploration, I guess. Revelio. Yeah, There has to be one over here. I actually want to go see, like, Great Hall. Let me go check, like, how cool it is in the winter. I'm getting better at it. Revelio. How did I let that slip by? I never seen him. I did all this area. Levioso. Revelio. Oh, here we might as well now that I didn't even see the most. Odd. I've been right here. I know that I've been down those other stairs. A 
Fuck you. And there's a page. Fuck. Lost. Found one. One would be somewhere. Look at that. <sighs> this one was moving weird. actually going through and collecting all these i don't even know what it gives you it's probably gonna give you a cloak i hope it's a cloak i hope it's something cool like that Akio. Oh, here we go. I get them first try, then I just can't do it. Halfway. We're almost halfway. I'm just walking around the castle. I have no idea where I'm going. I, there has to be one in this one. This wing just... It... it, it that's just it. Dude. Oh, whoever played that note did. Oh. I just heard one. Hello, Mr. I think it's inside the oh, greetings. faculty area. Uh, any luck I actually have some moons for you. So you have. Uh but bring me a few more, and I'll show you how to improve casting Alahamora. I'll keep an eye out for more demigod statues and see if I can bring you more moons. I commend you for your we'll courage. Got eleven out of thirteen. Valor, especially since I can only. I did. I already heard you say. Oh, there it is. There's that, and there's somewhere. Taking me out, see you I'm gonna get this one first. One, two, three. Oh. Half. Oh, wait, we're not half. We need one more for half. wasn't one in the library. Hey, I just heard it. Okay.
Oh, oh, I see, I see, I see. Right there. Halfway. I don't feel like doing this before I get off. Check this. Already check this. Go to the top. Right here, real quick. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Down there, so we're just gonna go. And we're at Ravenclaw Tower. I'm gonna go this way because I want to go to the top of the uh, moving staircase. That's so awesome. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. Your field guide? Oh my god, these stairs would be catchy. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Well, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. Mm -hmm. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. Mm -hmm. That noise. That would have been a good shortcut, actually. Revelio. This is a three, I think. Let's not teleport across school, though. Go to... I'll do the front wall last, man. Yeah. I did this. I doors oh man stream
I am not paying attention. Oh. Cross. Cross. That's it. Got six left. Oh, oh, nice to see you, my young friend. Else too. A dash of powdered bat spleen, I think. Okay. Defender. <laughs> you just cut that book up. Akio. Guardian Leviosa. Akio. Oh, Are they in here? Hey, James. I already got that one open. All right. I need to go up towards, like, um, I'm actually going to go into Gryffindor Tower just because I want to put. Another house token for the house chest. That's it. I'm making good progress with those tokens. This Dedalian Keys challenge is coming along nicely. It actually really is. Go to the greenhouse. That's where one's going to be at. For sure. That area. I haven't even been over here for this. Off on another adventure, are we? Down here first. I've never been down here. I've never seen this. I, I like swam in that water and everything. Oh. That's mad worth your little 500. Lumos. I don't hear one. Bad sign. I would assume I'm hearing it already. Ah. Uh. Dude, come on. I help here. Oh, it's you. Oh. Just the person I need. Samantha, is everything all right? No, no, it's not. It's my brother William. The one I told you about after charms class. He's he's been cursed. He ignored my warning, and now he's lying in St. Mungo's looking completely pathetic. He simply never listens. I'm sorry, how exactly has he been cursed? Oh, you won't believe it. Truly, but his feet were turned into purple beets. You can imagine his distress. And mine. 
I won't even go into the attention he was getting from our garden rabbits before he admitted himself to hospital. I'm so sorry. That sounds like a trying situation. I'm glad you understand. Everyone else just laughs at me as if it's a joke. No compassion at all. Well, it is an unusual situation. How did your brother end up like this? It's entirely his own fault. I told him about some research I'd done recently on our ancestor, Marmaduke Dale. Marmaduke. In particular, my discovery that Marmaduke's tomb was cursed. My brother's always making fun of my discoveries. This time, he laughed in my face. Told me I'd misinterpreted my findings. As if that weren't possible. And to prove his point, he went right up to the entrance of the tomb, and poof! His feet transfigured into beets. How awful. I can see why you're upset. He definitely needs some help. Exactly. He may be a cape flapper, but he's still my brother. And no one deserves such a fate to last forever. Especially as the result of a single brainless mistake. Now I worry that if the curse isn't reversed, it could become permanent. Can't the curse be broken? Possibly. The curse stems from a crest that was stolen from Marmaduke. If the crest were returned to its rightful place upon his sarcophagus, then I believe that William's feet may be restored. You battled trolls when they attacked Hogsmeade, escaped a dragon, and I could tell by your work in I charms stories, that you're a skilled insane. spellcaster. Returning a crest to a sarcophagus should be almost effortless for you. So, will you help us? I can take the crest to Marmaduke's sarcophagus for you. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. You'll simply go into the tomb where Marmaduke was laid to rest and place the crest on top of his sarcophagus. According to my research, the tomb's been abandoned for centuries, so it should be a fairly simple task. You'll find it just east of the hamlet of Brockbarrow. I'm not doing that right. Thank you for your help. My family is indebted to Really hoping that would lead me to I should like to retire from school. All right, let's go. Let's go six hours stream. Thank you guys for sticking with me. There this Revelio. Revelio. Oh, no. Maybe they're restricted. No, I did one in the tower. That's the first one I did. I didn't thought I was dead. I, mean, I guess let's just go higher and just uh party here.
protect my defensive power guards too. Far enough for one to spawn. Alright, let's let's look around the defense against the dark arts. Or actually let's just go down from here. Okay, we're close. Then I will be ending stream. I gotta go do a couple things. Oh, there's nothing. Do you think it pays to see him fight on city? Made any progress with your treasure map? That guy I forgot. <laughs> Hell, I forgot to do that dude's treasure map. No, I did not. Revelio. Open here real quick. Oh, yeah, this is. Rebellion. What are you up to now? Confringo. Accio. What do we have here? A demigod. Hey, where? Oh my god! I would have never thought to look here for this, dude. Fine now, demigod. Two. One more. I'm about to actually check that too. Might as well. I know where a couple are, but they're locked behind the locks that you get, or that you, yeah, the level threes that you get from getting more of these moons.
that floor or do that? Revelio. I actually think that's the entrance to the undergrowth. Okay, hold on. Right there. Revelio. That is the underground. God dang. How nice to see you, my young. Oh, oh. Hello, Hamora. Revelio. Damn. Damn, it's a level three. Oh, I actually want to know what's in there. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I did not even hear them. Oh, that was late as hell, but I got it somehow. I don't know how, but I did. I only need five more. Revelio. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Rebellion. Can I open this one? Hello, Hamora. Never go to Transfiguration, I guess. You only go there like once. Revelio. Professor Weasley. Dang it. I always hope I can just dodge roll out. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was. Well, I invented blue powder. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones.
Ah ouais. The greenhouse of the there. Went this way. It was actually much smaller than I thought. I thought it was big. Uh Revelio. Weird my Finite. I knew that. I go check down by where like Slytherin's at, and I don't even remember where Slytherin's at. Oh. I always get lost down there. Now that I want to go there, I. Big West Tower. That's the one I'm right next to that I started in. Basically. As well as check beast and that case there is one out here. Alohomora. That's fast. Just spin that shit, you'll hear it. Dusty. Fine now, dummy guys. Yes! I'm so happy I came out here now. I care if those things aren't here. I don't care. That is a shitter. That is a uh, place where you go to the rest. Revelio. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Hello, Hamora. I am. Uh... Bang. Revelio. here in the snow. Yeah. Lumos. I don't hear one. I heard already. All right, stream. That's it. That's the end of the stream for me. I'm about to be getting off. Let's check how much time we have put into the game already. We had 24 hours last night. Now we should have 30. Hey, I streamed the whole time today. 
All right. Uh, I'll catch you guys on tomorrow for sure. I'll be streaming again. Hopefully, if I'm not skating, I'll probably go out skating, actually. Um, but yeah, you guys don't have to go home. You can't stay here, though. I appreciate all you guys. Thank you for joining me. Deborah, I'll be hitting you up here soon.